Hello and welcome to more gaming fans. I'm your host Joe Zamora here, and we are bringing you live the second episode of Through the Regions for Diamond and Pearl and Platinum. Um, so today, like I said uh, on my post, we are going to take on the per ugly lady to start off the episode here, and we got most of our team that we wanted to use to level 18. But Jet Ski was just so low level and it was getting so late. I could only get to level 14. And uh, the code to do like the boosted experience was not working for me. So I guess I won't have that liberty in this game. Um, but we do have not to at level 18 with Scratch, Smoke Screen, Dragon Rage, and Ember. And Bell sitting with Mega Drain, Growth, Worry Seed, and Sunspore. And the quicker we get past this part, the quicker we can evolve our bell here. But let's go ahead and switch uh, not to to the front. We're going to go heal up our team. And let's go ahead and see if we can take down the lady with the purr ugly. Oh, my webcam's not on, is it? supposed to be on there we go now y'all can see my beautiful face um, let's click back on the game so we can actually play but how's y'all get a little how's y'all guys day going so far mine is good it's Friday got ourselves some whiskey coke to play to drink while we play along um, we got, we got to eat some pho today, which was delicious, as always. I got extra filet mignon in mine. And then, uh, for dinner, ate some tacos. So, it was definitely, a uh, unhealthy cheat day, <laughs> to say the least. But, let's go ahead and take on the Valley Woodworks. Alright, here we go. I'm one of Team Galactic's three commanders. No, wait. That's one of the four commanders. My name's Mars. We've been trying to create a new world that's better than this one. But people have shown little understanding about what we do. You don't understand either, do you? Do's you? It's a little saddening. So, let's have a little battle to decide what should we do next. If I win, you leave. If you win, we Team Galactic will leave. What do you say to that? Well, if you win, I lose the Nuzlocke. Okay, so she's going to go ahead and lead out a Zubat. Um, to avoid getting confused or anything, I'm going to go straight to Jet Ski here and Rock Tomb it. We are facing a lot of Zubats last night, so... I decided to um, teach it Rock Tomb. Damn it. Misclicked. Alright, so we're going to take some toxic damage, but we're fine. At least we're not confused on top of being poisoned. What do you think your Pokemon doing to my Pokemon? Uh, defeating it. Oh, shit, that's a bulky Zubat. Alright, so we gotta take another bite. Hopefully Toxic doesn't take us out here. Um, I'm actually gonna switch. Because the Toxic will take us out on the next turn. Alright, Bell, let's go ahead and send you out. You can take a bite. Um, go ahead and heal up our buddy in the back. Jet ski here. Alright, now we're going to heal up Bell. Uh, she can't be poisoned because I think she's part poison as well. So, good thing we have a grass poison on the team. Alright, uh, let's see. 
we took that bite no problem let's go ahead and go let's go ahead and see what G mega drain does we're faster so that's a good thing not enough all right so we're gonna switch out here after we heal again now you know what let's not heal jet ski come back out and quick attack will take the zoo bed out for sure All right, quick attack time. And it takes it down. So beautiful. We get past the first one with a lot of problems, really. But we'll see how this goes. All right, so per ugly, per ugly, per ugly is coming out. Let's go to Natsu here. Um, let's try to not lose a Pokemon here. All right, so I'm going to go for Dragon Rage, see how much it does. Okay, fake out. That's annoying. All right, so Scratch. So at least it's not Fury Swipes, but that still does a lot of damage. All right, so at least Dragon Rage will take it out on the next turn. So take the Scratch. Take the Scratch. Okay. Woo, that went down fast. I was like, oh, no, it's a crit. But it's okay. Her ugly is taken down. No problem. Natsu gets that 666 EXP. Almost gains a level, but doesn't. Alright. So Maz is not happy. Oops. I messed that one up. That's alright, though. I quite enjoyed our battle. My, my. Lose to a child, will you? But no matter. We've collected plenty of electricity. With the power we obtained, we can do something quite spectacular. It seems quite obvious to me, Sharon. The genius, even... The genius, even the boss recognized. Now, Mars, we should get going. Will you shut it? The boss is the only person in the world who's allowed to order me around. You can keep quiet around me. You only joined us recently don't think you're important or not i guess it's time to say goodbye and leave for the time being team galactic they were saying they had to gather pokemon and energy no matter what it was for creating a new universe or something they claim nothing they said made any sort of sense to me i can tell how you can't i can't tell you how grateful i am for you saving me i can finally see my little daughter again Papa! Yuck, Papa! You stinky! Go shower now, stinky. Oh, sorry. <laughs> they had me working non-stop. Thank you, trainer. You made those bad people go away. I think the balloon Pokemon will come visit again. Oh, today's Friday, too. Alright, let's go ahead and use our antidote. Get the fuck out of here! Alright. Ah, yes. It's you, yes. I have heard that the Team Galactic appeared at this power plant. I have therefore come running. So, the Team Galactic, where are they? You have run them off? You say you are a trainer, but... Very well. I shall go investigate inside. Alright. Oh, dang it. Now we gotta wait for him or what? Magnificent. Yes, it is. What you have said, it is all true. Superb. Though you are young, you are a trainer through and through. Very well. I shall pursue the culprits. I have received tips that the Team Galactic Hideout is in Eterna City. To there I must be off. Today is Friday, so, I mean, you would think the balloon Pokemon would be there. Let's see if it goes there whenever we go back. 
Is it a certain time of day that it's there? I think it's just there. Alright, so... Our Pokemon are fully healed and ready to go, so let's go ahead and take on some more trainers! So we got Blazo leading the way. He slathers sweet honey on a, a sweet smelling tree. Pokemon may be attracted by the sweet scent. I know this. I just can't do it. Hey, how about you and me battle before I go to Eternus Forest? Okay, yeah. I am down to clown. Bonita. Oh wait, no, Natu's leading the way. I should have had Weasel leading the way. That would have been an easy win for him. Run like a wind, run like a wind. Alright, so the next gym is level 22, the highest. So we'll try our best not to go over that. I'm sure not to would be the one running the running the gauntlet on that though. There's no mountain here, but I'm dressed to hike. Aha! Here we goes nothing. <coughs> here it goes. All right, deal, dudes. We can battle. A water gun. Alright, another Geodude, so obviously water gun. Oh boy. That Geodude was level 11. Still stood no chance. It's okay, Jet Ski. We're about to take out another Geodude. I think Geodude got sturdy in Gen 5, because... They, none of these Pokemon have sturdy right here. Woohoo! Level 15 for Jet Ski. Alright, trying to learn Swift, but we're not going to learn that because it's special. And uh, I checked it out, and it's his physical moves that are going to be helping us out. I mean, naturally, it is a physical attacker. But due to its ability, it's negative uh, special attacking nature. So, something we gotta deal with. I love Pokemon that smell sweet. Like this one. Get a whiff of this. Cheap arts. Here, take a whiff. Rosalia! The Pokemon we're trying to get. <laughs> long day, long day. Alright, so Nazi's gonna come out here because Roselia's gonna be a threat. So, Ember, it goes. Oh, critical hit! I'm, I bet we needed it. Alright, Roma Lady Elizabeth. You have been taken out. Now let's go ahead and continue on. What kinds of Pokemon live around here, I wonder? Who knows? Alright, so Bidoof comes out. Jet Ski's ready to take this thing on. Go ahead and go for a Pursuit. And he goes for Defense Curl. So now we start going for Water Gun. Ooh, and water, does, water Gun does a good amount of damage, but he continues to growl us. But good thing we're using special attacks. And down goes Bidoo.
All right, we got Pachirisu, so we're going to go Bell here. Bell resists electric attacks. And it's pretty defensive, so it can pretty much take anything this Pachirisu decides to do. All right, we go Mega Drain here. A good chunk. It looks to be about a... I want to say it's going to take four hits total. So three more. Hopefully just two more, but... My experience, it's normally extra an extra little notch because they live on one oh but lucky for us a three hit ko all right let's keep it going here bell gets the exp and we beat the picnicker Let's go ahead and get some of these berries right here. Sadly, uh, not the friend-making kind. But at least orange and peach berries are useful in their own right. Alright, so now we have a heal ball. Oh, man. I, I was hoping... I don't know why I read bell. And there's nothing here. Oh, wait, look, there is something there. Stardust. Hmm. I always thought there was nothing there. I'm gonna let this picnicker see me so we can beat her, too. It's a long way between Floroma and Eterna City. So let's battle. Just don't have grass types, please. Oh, you bastard. I want an A palm. It's not fair. And like I said, each tree is its own encounter. I just gotta find time to make it happen. Cause I know we're gonna end up with the combi. On one of them at least. I'm really hoping for an Apom and a Heracross for this, this playthrough. Because Apom can evolve, and Heracross is just fucking monstrous in a playthrough. So I've heard, because I've never got to use it. But we will see. Alright, go ahead and... Ugh. Potion up Jet Ski real quick. Ooh, and finally, an easier battle for Jet Ski to deal with. Another hiker. Alright, water gun! I was meaning to stream earlier, but... I didn't... I didn't have time. My wife likes to watch Law and Order, and I watch TV with her, so. I was like, okay, one more episode. Let's do this. Chillos! Oh, there's a different route. I can catch a Chillos. I can. Okay, so let's go ahead and go for... Let's just throw a Pokeball. See what happens. Pokeball! I mean, I'm going to use Jet Ski primarily. But Chalice is a good backup mod to have. I've just already done all this work to raise it. Uh, let's go for Rock Tomb. Okay, so we can do one more rock tomb and catch it. Alright. And, uh... Let me figure out a nickname for this. Ooh, beautiful. 
Now we throw a heel ball because that's gonna be beautiful. Pink and pink. So it's pink in the middle. Mm. Alright, heel ball it is. Let's go. Alright, we got the shellos. And let's see what we're gonna name it now. It's a boy shallows. We're gonna name it Don. Donny! It's Mr. Don Boy over here. Thank you. So now we have Don the Shellos as a backup. Alright, now we got to switch up. Come on, Jesse, kick his ass. Water gun. Alright, let's see that. Did a good chunk, so let's go for water gun again. Uh oh, focus energy time. Water gun, do the job. Get the kill! Oh, and it lives on one, but luckily he goes for Leer. That would have been a problem. The water gun finally takes him down. It only took four. That's what I was talking about earlier. And we defeat Battle Girl Casey. Kelsey. Whatever. And now we got a repel. So we can't go this way because it's cut tree. We're on Route 205. What's this house? Repels are useful, don't you think? Oh, yeah, cool. Yeah, I'll take rest. My shop needs some milk. <laughs> yeah, it, it, but all we had was water for it, so it didn't do shit. Hey, Admiral, welcome to the stream. Like your cat emoji. Alright, let's see here. Oh, I don't know. Should I play a little? Sounds sus. Oh, and she got a piplup. Alright, so Pip Love takes this pursuit rather well, actually. Let's go for Rock Tomb, see if that does more. It's a penguin, so it can't fly. It's not flying type. Alright, goes for Peck there. And we're going to finish it off with Rock Tomb, hopefully. Unless we get a low roll again of Breaking Force. All right, quick attack time. And Piplo finally goes down. We can finally enter the turn of four. Boo-hoo. Yeah, go shut up, little girl. Little girl. All right, we can't go that way yet, but once we get Surf, we're going to catch ourselves a Magmar. I forgot to talk to that guy. Maybe he gives us something. Many poison type Pokemon make the home in their turn of four. But I don't I didn't buy any antidotes. What should I do? Do I press on or go back? Don't be like me, bruh. Press on. Hello, my name's Cheryl. And you are? Okay, so your name is Joe. I am sincerely glad to meet you. Joe, may I ask you a big favor? I want to get through this forest, but I'm afraid to do it alone. I've heard that there are there is a sinister group of people called Team Galactic about. I think there's there'd be a safety in numbers. Please, may I go with you? Alright, so we didn't get a choice. Cheryl just decides to jump on in. Alright, so... I, I don't count my encounter until after she's gone. Because... 
she can accidentally knock out your encounter, and I don't want to deal with it. Because if it's a Pokemon I really want, I'm going to be like, Ooh, bitch. Killed my encounter. But, uh, let's go ahead and come this way. Badoof and Baniri. Go ahead and run. Okay, is there anything over here? Nope. Just grass. So we're going to go back up and do that battle. Ooh, we can get a Gashly in here. That's going to be nice. Hopefully we can get it. I mean, technically, I don't really care for it. I would, but we can't evolve it. And you saw how big of a pain it was to get Tarmander in this game. What cool? What's cool, you might ask? No, I tell you anyway. Bug Pokemon. We're just on a power walk. Oh, power walk. You don't say. Standing still. Alright, Pachirisu is level 16. Um, I'm gonna go to Natsu. Gotta play this one safe. Oh, I wish I would have known. That that uh, spark was gonna destroy our our, uh, our water type there. So good thing I did not stay in. All right. Now let's just go ahead and go for the Dragon Rage on to Pachirisu. Alright, so it hangs on. And now it sparks us. So yeah, very safe play. Oh, great. Now we gotta deal with the Paralysis. Wurmple goes down, though. Alright, so Silkoon comes in. All right, we're gonna go for the Ember on Silcoon. Pachirichu just fast. Goes for the Ember on us again. Oh, thank goodness. Chansey goes Egg Bomb on the right Pokemon because I forgot we were slower. So Jetski gets to level 17. Ooh, and Natsu's raised up to level 20 now. We get the Ember off on Silcoon and down it goes. Beautiful. Beautiful! All right, now Beautifly is coming in. Uh-oh. Go ahead and get an Ember off on this thing as well. So the good thing about playing with Cheryl through this, uh, through this, uh, what do you call Through the forest. There we go. The good thing about playing with uh, Cheryl through the forest is she heals your Pokemon after each battle. So, wild battle or not, your Pokemon are healed up every time. Shit! I'm, I was going to try to do a single battle. I see, I see. I see you going down and defeat! I'm going to train in a Pokemon bond. I don't care. Let's battle. Let's battle! Ooh, level 17 Abras. They mean business. Alright, we'll go for the one on the left. Do not be an electric or grass type hidden power, please. Of course. You better not have doubled into jet ski. I'm gonna be severely pissed. Don't you dare. And there's another reason why I want to do single battle. No! Fuck you! Well, at least we have a replacement, Don. We're going to go ahead and switch out to not to. Oh, fuck me. 
Oh, now you want to eat the fucking candy? Stupid bitch. God damn it, this fucking game. Alright, stretch. And that abra goes down. That fucking filthy whore. Shit, you're fucking around. That really grinds my gears. Alright, done. We'll get the fuck up front so I can switch train you. Oh, that hurts my heart. Oh, look, two Badoo. I really wanted to use Buizo on this. This doesn't count. I'm trying to run away. Fuck off. Trying to leave. Come on, dude. Really? I'm not gonna take no absorb. Thank you, Chancy, for the XP, but I'm trying to leave. Netball! You got me a netball here. Alright, my senses tingle. I've spotted a rare Pokemon. That's gross, man. Your, your tingling sensation for Pokemon? You're a sick man. Alright, Don. Time for you to get some EXP, baby. So now, Natsu's gonna have to be over-leveled because this game likes to fuck me over. This game likes to bend me over and say, alright, time to take it. And since I'm doing Nuzlocke, I have no choice but to just be like, okay! Alright, so Burmy is coming in. So Don's going back out to get the switch training leveled. All right, not two. Come back out. And the worst part is, it's not even Pokemon. Uh, uh, Bell can train against. So it's just like, come on, cut me some slack here. All right, so not two is officially level twenty-one. Lots well, of scary face. That's not happening. So funny to see that but chop needs some milk here comes the swarm all right a worm pool maybe Don can handle this let's see what you got Don Don got some power. Fire power. Get away from me. A little bug flying around here. Right, that's cool. We can handle. We can handle. We can handle shells. It's a shell of the town. We can handle this. Bulky bitch. So water pulse again, confuse them. Get that confusion. Ooh, 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 for the very first time. Just confuse him. All right, Don gets to level 11 all on his own. Learns Mud Bomb too. Better than Mud Slap, so let's get it in there. Mm. 
Bug Catcher Philip is about to send out Dust Ox. Ooh, that's that's a tough one. Um, all right, Don. Let's see if we can tank it. No, no. Five, uh, four levels above. Nope, not gonna even chance it. Let's go ahead and send out Natsu. He's got a fire in his belly and he's ready to let it out. Ain't playing no game. We just lost a Pokemon. Ain't playing no game. Amber. Dust Tox goes down. All right, we got Dawn. Level 12. Dawn with an O in. Not an A. W. Yeah. Not what I was trying to go. Well, I mean, I was trying to go there, but I wasn't trying to uh, get in a wild encounter. Oh, excuse me. Water poles. You can take these on. Oh, of course, you missed your egg bomb. Damn, Baneri specially defensive. That girl thick. She's just getting thicker by the minute. Wonder if Egg Bomb was actually physically offensive. Seems like it would be, right? All right, let's go ahead and finally take out this Baneri. Come on, Inspector Benary. You see me now? Oh, you're dead. <laughs> Gotta love it. Free EXP. Anything but Badu is free EXP. I ain't playing with that shit. But Neri had Harden, right. Am I tripping or did it use Harden? Weird. Weird, man. Weird. Mm -hmm. Alright, so we got another potion. Stocking up on these things since Cheryl's helping us out. She's being our uh, healer mama. Strange presence has been felt. Oh, up your ass. It is emanating from you. Oh, wait, never mind. Nope, not up your ass. Not up your ass. Uh, you are challenged by Psychic Cody with the Metatides. Level 17. Holy shit. Alright, Bell. Come uh, make a statement. Don't kill me with confusion. That's all I have. Alright, so it's going for meditate again. So it's plus two attack now. That's scary. There ain't no Gyarados, but I don't go fuck. That's scary. Plus two attack is plus two attack. All right, go for it again. Okay, confusion special. All right, cool. I'm gonna take that. Whew, that scared me. I was like, confusion, no! The one move I told you not to use. Oh no, my meditate. Yeah, it's dead. And the next morning, the fuck was dead. Alright, so Don comes out. Excuse me, by the way. Don comes out, and do we have water absorbed? 
No, we have sticky holes. Ugh. Why? Alright, well, Bell's gonna come out here. Help you out. Man, if we had water absorbed, we were fine. But nope. We had to get unlucky and get the only shellos in the fucking region without it. It's okay, though. Psychic's gonna go... I mean, Psyduck's gonna go down. Here. I hope it wasn't using Psychic. We could not handle that right now. Don gains to level 13, and Bell is almost at level 19. So, Bell finally being able to uh, work her way up. All right, all right, all right. Let's go ahead and go for a water pulse on Buneary. Like I said, EXP is EXP, and right now we're going to take what we can get. And also, just a reminder, once we get out, once we get Cheryl out of the forest, we'll be coming back to do our encounter. Because I don't trust it getting my encounter with her, so my way i always do it that way so 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 deal with it oh it endured the hit okay so it endures all the hit holy shnike that's an interesting one egg bomb like a stink bomb, right? Now we can finally take down the slit silkoon that's just chilling over here. And one more time to take it down. Look at you. You come on here in your time of need and you show me no respect. The Don does not take kindness to that. Alright, so that one's down. Okay. Uh, oh, that's the opposite side. So we, we just made a one. A big old 180 right there. Creaky toot! I wouldn't mind using the dilly lily -li -li whoop. Either. I've never used one. And then again, who has? Yeah, fuck that. I'm gone. Oh, why'd I do that? I want to progress. Boom, 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 boom. Great, now we can't run away. You know what? Let's let's stick this one out, I guess. Oh shit, we can't escape. I was trying to push up, but it didn't it didn't go. Because if Chance could take down Badu that easily, then I could take out the Silk Moon. Might as well. Damn it! I did it again. Gotta push side when you're on run. Alright, we already went down. Only way left to go is up! All right, water pulse on Badoo. Badoo goes for water sport. Weak inspired type move, but there ain't a fire type in sight. I wish it boosted water type attacks too. That'd be awesome. But Badoo is going to sit there and hit itself or go for ground. That too. Hoping it would hit itself, though. And of course, Egg Bomb misses while we get absorbed. Or do you go for Chansey? 
even better. Now, Badoo, hit yourself in confusion so this can be over. Nah, it won't be over. Oh, it is! Oh, I thought it was too much HP. Oh, Badoo goes down. Don finally gets to level 14, and we're sitting pretty. We do not evolve until level 30, though. So, that's a problem. I don't know what level uh, Weasel evolved at, but I do know Shallows doesn't evolve to level 30. So, that's something we gotta deal with. And Badoo finally goes down. Alright, so I found a green shard. There's one item I'm really looking for here. Alright, water pulse into the Krikatot. Water pulse. Oh yeah. Confused. Hit yourself. Hit yourself. Yes. Okay, now let's go ahead and take out the veneer. Oh man. And hopefully Krikatot hits itself again. Yes. Beautiful. It took itself out. Of course, since he used Endure, he's going to live. That's not very nice of you to do in front of my presence. Veneri going for that defense curl. So, not hardened. But, eh, didn't work out for you, did it? That's a short forest. Oh, there's the exit. I'm so relieved we finally got here. I would have never been able to get through this by myself. Thank you so much, Joe. This is a token of my appreciation. Oh, there you go. I just about to Google where Sooth Bell at. So let's go ahead and slap that bad boy on Bell. Give it the Sooth Bell. Give Don the Quick Claw. And we can't access this yet, so. Time to continue on. Well, it's 205, right? 205 was also the route down there, so we can't catch a Pokemon at that grass like I normally do. Holy shit! Something I never would have known. Alright, so this is our encounter. Kaku. I think it evolves into Beautifly, but... Not too big on caring what bug type this thing turns into. And already, the Quick Claw popping off. Yeah, that should be good. Let's go ahead and give Cascoon a Pokeball to live in. Pokeball, go! Wow, are you are you fucking kidding me right now? All right, Cascoon, I'm gonna be like that, you whore. It caught finally. Two attempts is finally, but still finally. 
All right, Cascoon was caught, and let's see, what do we nickname it? Um, let's name it. Excuse me. Let's name it Heather. Why not? No way, it's a guy. Let's name it Jack. Hey, Mr. Jack. Something, something, something. Oh, I didn't see your comment. Sorry, Admiral 21. I. I should have named this Spike, you're right. Don't look at me like that. Oh, yeah? Alright, so now we got to uh, take on these guys. And you know, we got to have um, Bell up front. So hopefully by level 22 it evolves. That'd be fucking nice. I guess that first one's not a battle, but these next three should be. Alright, let's go ahead and go for this Mega Drain here. And, uh, these are a lot of water type Pokemon. Reminds me of a story. So, my little brother loved fish at a, one point. Just wanted to have fish as, as pets in the fish tank. So, my dad took him to the store, him and my mom, and they went to the store for PetSmart, probably. No, it was Walmart. Walmart still sold fish then. They went to the store, they got all the stuff they needed for a fish. They got all the fish tank stuff, they got the water thing, they did everything. But, everything you could for the fish and they bought all kinds of fish they bought like six or seven different varieties of fish and the people said yeah they could live together it's fine and one was cool because it was like a little serpent fish like a little dragon looking one and that's of course the one my brother wanted the most because it looked so cool well they set up everything for the fish and like for a day or two it was like oh that's cool they got fish and then on the third day, I guess the fish all died from shock because they put them in too early. So all the fish, one by one, but boom, but boom, but boom, all died. And the only one that was left was like a sucker fish, I think. And I was like, yeah, they're the hardiest animals out of all the fish at the pet store. So it makes sense. So. My little brother was obviously upset. He was like, oh, I wanted fish, I wanted fish, and they all died. And I was like, and then my dad was like, all right, go buy some more and do it right this time. So they did it right. They let the fish sit out and stuff. And I don't know. I don't know what happened. I guess, like, because certain fish lived, certain fish didn't. And I guess they bought certain fish food, and I guess it wasn't good enough for all the fish. So, like, half the fish died. The dragonfish was, of course, one of the first ones to go again. I guess it needed something different. But, you know, it is what it was. But they had, like, a goldfish for a long time. So, at least that lived for a while. I used to have a beta fish. And I took care of it myself. I, I had it for, like, a good four or five months. And then eventually it died. I cleaned the bowl like four or five times. And those are some hardy fish. Uh, those are the fish you want to get kids if you're going to get kids fish. Just only get one though. Because if you get two, they'll fight. Not that I've ever done it, but they're called Japanese fighting fish for a reason. Or Chinese fighting fish. One of those two. But if you put two beta fish that are male in the same tank, they will fight to the death. Fun little tidbit about fish. As we're destroying a bunch of fish with our plant.
All right, and this should be the last magic card. That's where I do why I told the story. There's too many fucking fish to fight. I mean, who the fuck just has six magic cards on your team? Six Gyarados makes sense. Six magic cards don't. But, you know. It's Pokemon. They don't make sense sometimes. I finished up some tough Pokemon. Let's have ourselves a little battle. Okay. Alright, so Magikarp again. Super tough fish. Way to get a tough fish. I could fish for one right now. Probably be higher level. Alright, so Unifish over here. Unicorn fish. Golding, 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 golding. Hey, Mega Drain. Gonna destroy this fish. Beautiful. Fantastic. Alright, so now one more magic card to go. And we're not gonna get to level 21 after that, so. Losing to a kid has me something. Oh, gasping like a magic card. <laughs> and we, now we have guard spec. <laughs> Terry Berry. <laughs> sleepy, man. Jesus Christ. Don't eat before you stream. You're going to get sleepy. Alright, so now we got cherry berries and orange berries and berries of all kind in our bag. I'm not gonna plan any yet. Why is that interesting? Oh, it's just the game glitching out. I was like, why is the water coming out? It's the flood! It's been pro predicted as in the prophecy! Alright, now we gotta put Buizo on the death box because it's day old. So let's go ahead. <laughs> this thing is Pokemon. We worked so hard to get. Is dead. I need to stop saying I want to use Pokemon on the team because those are the ones that tend to die. <sighs> Fuck! Why can't I stop? Move, bitch. Get out the way. Super potion. Alright, I'm gonna switch train until we get to the gym leader. Hi, I'm Cardinia. I'm this town's gym leader. My last challenger was this awfully speedy young guy. Actually, his name was Eddie. He told me about you. He said that another challenger's on the way, so, made, so that made me antsy. At my gym, no one gets to battle with the gym leader until the end the gym leader has to beat all other gym trainers first i'll be waiting for you in the back trainer don't disappoint yeah well you're gonna have to wait because uh, i'm looking for shit all right 
you don't have to tell me you want to explore a kit, go talk to them at the Pokemon Center. Or near the Pokemon Center. Okay. This is where we get Togepi too. Hello, I'm the official name writer. Want me to write the name of your Pokemon? Which Pokemon should I critique? Yeah, I need to put the extra E at the end of Bell. It's a bell. So finally fixed her name. Um, was there another name I needed to fix? Yeah, dude. Oh no. We had Loretta and Samantha and Natsu and Don. Alright, please come visit again. Maybe. Excuse me, but do you have... <laughs> they did this on purpose! Excuse me, do you got that Pokemon named Weasel? Want to trade for a Chatot? I would have loved to trade for a Chatot. Look at this. Look at my comments. Chatot! Chatot! Can I get a Hanya? Hanya! Can I get a Hanya? No Hanyas for us. I would have loved to trade for a Chatot. You guys need to let me know if I'm allowed to trade dead Pokemon for Pokemon. Hi, I'm the building superintendent. I maintain a vigilant 24 hour watch. Oh, well, you must never get sleep. Gardini, our gym leader, goes out to the Eternal Forest every so often. I wonder, I always wonder what she does there. Oh. The booby recycle needs to be during the battle. When you use recycle, Pokemon can use this item once again. Oh. And the old lady gives us recycle? I've had this TM recycle for such a long time. It's not anything that I have much use for these days. I do hope you pull it to good use, good trainer. Well, let me get that fucking Snorlax and I, I, I'll recycle all day, baby. Give me them curses. I'll do it. Badges from gyms or contest wins. There are many... Oh, Badges from gyms or contest wins. There's more than just one way to... Be a winner, it seems. Here is hoping you'll find something in which you can be the victor. I said he's gonna give me an item. Worthless. I'm gathering up a lot of berries, so I'm trading them for accessories. Next stop, Heart Home City. I'm taking the contest challenge. All right. You can't catch me. I set some traps. I got you. Ha! Ah! Failure. Ah, I got you now. I'm gonna take your flag. I don't know what that's about, but, you know, it is what it is. But tell me, guys. Can I get a Hanya? Guess not. Uh, this is Old City, blah, blah, blah. No, I want items. I want the items. Turner City is not anything like it was before, way back in the day. I'll tell you what. Alright, can't go that way. Alright, so it's about Team Galactic, and then, have you seen our building? Team Galactic is so stinking rich that we can have one built instantly. Right. Must be nice to be that rich. I want to be that rich one day. Alright, so he gives us the Explorer Kit that we can't leave town without. And it's just like, oh, come on, man. I would go underground, but there's no underground thing anymore. How on earth armor and school fossils? I wonder how. 
Oh, okay. So you can trade uh, items with him. Probably. Don't look at me. I don't know. Uh oh. Good. Hey, Joe. You came to see the Pokemon statue, right? I'll take you there. All right, Eddie. Always so excited to do fun things. What the? So, this is Eternus Pokemon statue. Shaping our world, our time, and space. In an intertwining spiral. Revered and Sinnoh are the Pokemon of time and space. Sinnoh's myth. Its truth needs investigation. Pardon me, aside. Stand aside. Well, at least he's polite. Oh, hey. When we smacked together, a brilliant flash of inspiration came to me. An easy way to become a great trainer, yeah? That? All right. Listen close. Make certain all your attacks hit. Avoid enemy attacks for sure. You do that, you'd never lose. You'd be the invincible trainer anyway so check out the pokemon statue see you around and just like that he's gone with the win they say that this is an awesome pokemon that people saw long ago so the cool thing about this statue is um it looks like both palkia and dialga Ooh, item oh, i can't get it till after cut damn it i want my piece of candy Hey there. Hey, you there, kid. Stay away from the Pokemon statue. Team Galactic is conducting an official investigation here. Uh, how about you go suck a dick? Alright. Useless information. Useless information. Useless information. Oh, I want to know what it said, actually. The first inscription went like this, sort of. Creation of the Alga, giver of time. In laughter, there is tears and likewise. The same time flows the blessing of the Alga. Yikes, I've forgotten big chunks of it. Want to hear another? No. You've wasted my time, child. Alright, 211 encounter, and it is the Machop. So 207 and 211. Ha! Ah, hilarious. So, we're gonna go ahead and Mega Drain the Machop. Again, I guess. And then Stun Sport, because we don't want to activate the Guts ability before we need to. And go ahead and get those nicknames going for Machop. I'm looking at the chat! Focus energy. Alright, let's go ahead and get the stun spore going and then throw the Pokeball. Pokeball, go! Oopla! Alright, we caught it. Now what do we name it? The small in stature, though small in stature, it is powerful enough to easily heft and throw a number of Geodudes at once. Geodude, Geodude, what the fuck, Geodude? Alright, Machop. Let's go ahead and name you... We're gonna nickname you Holly. Because you muscular as hell and you look like Holly Holmes. Ooh, battle. Do that. Doesn't that sound like a ninja bursting from cover? 
Sure. So this boy got Zubats. Gross. Let's go ahead and throw out Dawn. From the dawn of time, beauty and the beast. All right, water pulse it is. And our quick claw comes into play there. And we go ahead and hit that zoo back with the water pulse. Taking Astonish, but we don't flinch. Water Pulse goes through and Zubat is now confused. Hit yourself. Hit yourself. Itch. No target. It's okay. That's all right. That's okay. You're going to pump our gas someday. Tried to supersonic us, but Don don't have ears. Where was he gonna hear you, son? Well, we confused him, and he heard himself. Beautiful. And this water pulse should do the trick. Gone, oh, baby. All right, one last Zubat to go, and Don is looking like she is in a nip, or he's in a nifty. Spot right now. Uh oh, our quick claw goes off again. That Zubat is in trouble as it takes a water pulse straight to the dome. Does not get confused though, so very interesting on that part. Now that Zubat goes for leech life, and we're going for a second water pulse. And we do it. Water pulse for the final time. Thanks to our quick claw, we go first, and down goes Zubat. And we're finally level 15, so we're, we're making progress. Gone with the wind, gone with the wind, yeah. So let's go ahead. Yeah, fuck it. Let's use a super potion. Ooh, 26. Fully healed. Oh, we had a regular potion. It's okay, Don. You're worth it. And we found a great ball. Fantastic for us. We still have a chance to catch a Shingly. And again, I would not mind using a Chingling because I've never used Trimeco in a playthrough before. I think it just evolves regularly too. Look it up. Chime Chime! Chimeco. Uh. Oh, fuck. Friendship at night. Oh, good thing we play at night. But, still, friendship. It's not our encounter, though. Just yet. So. We will see. But Onyx, take this water pulse. Hold that form of sun. Ooh, down goes Onyx. The full Onyx goes down. And Don gains 415 EXP. Give me that level. Wants to learn hidden power. Um, we can make room for much sport, and then we'll figure out what your hidden power is later. Let's 
Jesus, I need to clean my glasses too. Oh man, I've been slouching too, guys. So that I, that's probably why. I, also, I'm yawning a little bit. Just in a very relaxed state. Playing some Pokemon, chilling and slouching and drinking, and you know, it's a beautiful concoction. All right, Mount Cornet, what's our encounter? Ding ling! Oh, what chop? We already have one. It's gonna be a chain link, and I'm definitely gonna use it if I have the chance. But man, I gotta evolve Chingling by friendship and chime and uh chime and um what you call it? Ooh, energy powder. <laughs> Need the energy man. <laughs> Look, but dude. We already have a zoo bat too. So I guess all the options are gonna be Chingling. Never popped out. All right, let's see. Is this super effective? It's super effective. So it could be either rock, psychic. Yeah, rock or psychic. Or electric. Or ice. Shit, it could be a lot of things. We'll use it on my chop in a little bit and see. Ice heal. Not that we need to worry about that. Ooh, stardust. I need to check all these little rocks. Holy shit. Got some stardust from that rock man. I'm drinking now. Oh, look at this. Bronzong. I don't think I've ever used Bronzong in a playthrough either. I think I tried once and it died. Alright, let's use Hidden Power and see if it's still super effective. Or not very effective. If it's not very effective, it could be either Ice or Psychic. Okay, Ice or Psychic. So that narrows it down. I mean, Rock too. Shit. Okay. All right. Let's go ahead and Water Pulse this thing. Wow, that's a whole key. But so are we. Uh oh. Alright, so now I'm just gonna start chucking Pokeballs because if it keeps hitting itself, that don't be a problem. Alright, so Don's asleep too, so that's irritating. Bell, we're going to switch to Bell, get the stun spore off to ensure the easier catch. There we go. Stun spore is off on the brown zone. And that's a better psychic type than Chimeco anyway. Bloop, 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 bloop. I honestly forgot Chimeco even existed too. So that's two Pokemon already that I forgot even existed. And that's embarrassing for Chimeco too, because I played uh, Conquest not too long ago, and it's on there. Alright, it's Premier Ball. Mmm. Yeah. Give me that bronze ore. Clink, clink. All right, Bronzor nickname. What do we nickname this thing? It's genderless, so it could be whatever. Story of Near and Bell. Uh 
Didn't say the name of the young woman. <laughs> I'm just gonna nickname it the story of the bell. Wait. Quaden. I know it's probably pronounced way differently. But that's how I'm gonna that's how I'm gonna say it. Probably the case probably silent. Si uh, silent, so it's probably white on. Wait on, wait on, wait on, wait on, wait on, wait on, wait on. I don't know, man. I'm not a liter uh, liter literary expert. I can't even fucking talk. What do you want from me? Alright, Don, we're gonna need you to wake the fuck up. So here's a potion. Ooh, 19 almost. And now we got an awakening for you, too. Look at these beautiful wings. Look at these beautiful wings. Now I want wings. Thanks a lot, lady. Starly. Uh, let's go for hidden power. I want to see what it is. If it's super effective, it's rock type. Oh yeah, it's a rock type. It's rock type. Oh no, Endeavor brings us down to, oh no, what the fuck? Why is it inaccurate? Don, don't fucking play with me. Don't play with me right now. Quick attack. That is 10 damage. Oh, you went for double team, that's why. Don't you dare, don't you dare do it. Don't miss again! Son of a bitch, you would miss. You know what? Just kill Don too. Fuck this. Holy shit. Don, you're being ridiculous right now. Thank you for not being fucking worthless. Starly finally goes down. And Don gets 204 EXP for that. All right, now we got hoot hoot. Uproar. That should do nothing. Almost nothing. Rock type move. Super effective, baby. I'll take that. We take those. Mm, I don't like the damage you're doing. Now we gotta waste another super potion. Thanks a lot, Dawn. Alright, well, let's go ahead and do another hidden power here. Everyone's busy on a Friday night. They don't want to hang out with me today. Guess I can't peep with. I can't peep. I can't compete with SmackDown. It's John Cena! Alright, let's go ahead and... Oh, not get caught there. Hey, look, could've got bronze ore here, too. Chingling! Chingling does not want to be used this time around. <sighs> oh, 
Oh, cool, Cynthia. Oh, that device you have. It is a Pokedex. Wow, it brings back so many memories. Pardon me, but what's your name? Okay, hello, Joe. I'll be sure to remind to remember that name. My name is Cynthia. I'm a trainer just like you. I've been studying Pokemon mythology lately, just out of curiosity. Here in Eterna City, there is a statue of an ancient Pokemon. Have you seen it already? According to the myth, it was an extremely powerful Pokemon. You know, you may consider something like it with while you're traveling with your Pokedex. Oh, I know. Try using this. It should be helpful. Alright, so she gives us HM01 for cut. But we still gotta beat the gym first. Look, Cynthia, I don't need your shit right now. I'm trying to I'm trying to do big baller things. Big baller! Baller, shot collar, 20 inch blade on the Impala. Holler, get laid tonight. Something, 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 something tonight. Hit the highway in the middle of the flyway. That's all I know. Hey, get away, get away, get away, yeah! Alright, time to take on the gym. Fuck it. Time. It is on. No pun intended because it's a big ass fucking clock in here. Oh. You member. Look, we got member Barry on the other side. You member. You member. You member. Alright, so Cherubi is going for a tackle, and we're going for the Ember attack. Man, Ember does not do nowhere near enough. Well, it does near enough, but come on, man. Two hit KO and a Cherubi? Get your shit together. Alright, Roselia coming in. Let's go ahead and switch train for Dawn again. <laughs> I almost made a clawful mistake. Mega Drain! But it doesn't affect our million. No, it does not. At least not very much. But Roselia does seem to be very specially defensive here. As it lives in Ember and goes for another Mega Drain. Natsu is not done yet as he continues with the Ember Onslaught. Don growing to level 17. Natsu also growing to me XP, but not quite a level just yet. A little bit over half. You can walk on its hands. That's how you get to the next trainer. Interesting. Three days later. That was a little over dramatic, don't you think? Ah, uh, Gardenia, I'm over here. I'm running in your flower bed. I'm probably going to kick my ass for that. My grass type Pokemon can sold out some serious special attacks. I won't let you win easily. I don't expect you, sweetheart. That's why it's called a gym challenge. Oh boy, oh boy, oh me, oh my, oh, oh my god. What's going on, too? Badoo. Do you how to, Badoo? Take an ember, will you? Who woo? I don't know. I, I'm losing my goddamn mind at this point. Just kill the dang thing. And it lives on a pixel. 
And it also gets paralysis. Always a good time. Always a good time when you send out fucking Time Millie and destroy grass types and he's just like, nope, I'm okay. Alright, so. Badoo comes out again. Go ahead and switch to Dawn. Uh. All right, switch back out to Natsu. <laughs> oh, righty then. Go for Dragon Ring. Her firepower was weakened. Oh, well, Dragon Rage does enough to do the trick. Alright, Badoo comes out again. Dawn, get to level 18, please. Be of use for once in your fucking life! But for real, though. Swap out my guy Dragon Rage Well I should not see him live on one Oh, we killed it! We fucking killed it! And one more piano for a little bit of beautiful flowers. <sighs> Come on, fellas! We gotta get hype in the chat. Let's go. Paralyzed. Hey, you baby. Energy powder does the trick. Not to took that powder in. He's good to go. He's ready to fight. You can't win when you're distracted by the lovely aroma of Pokemon. <laughs> you guys, my wife. I hate perfume. Screw the aroma. Just get me out of this gym. Alright, Don. It's coming out. Not two is going in. Alright, time for a little ember action. Feels like our firepower is weakened, but it's not. Alright, so we get stun spored again. That's not too bad. We can kind of deal with it. It's better than being poisoned, right? Alright, ember goes down. We get to level 22. Dawn's almost at level 18. I guess one more switch battle and it'll be there. Or not. Sorry. Uh, what's your face? You're going to have to wait. Alright. Let's go heal up our Pokemon. Put uh, Buy some potions for sure. And put Charizard, Charmeleon up front. And let's go ahead and take on this gym. Whew. We're already at level 22 at the second gym. That's a big difference compared to what we de dealt with in Heart Gold, Soul Silver. We weren't level 22 until after the third gym. So I guess the importance of levels.
got to get these battles in some way, somehow, you know what I'm saying? Go ahead and get some super potions. We'll get 10. Go ahead and get five regular ones just in case. And while we're here, let's go ahead and get 10 more Pokeballs. Mm, let's get the fuck out of it. Oh, wait, hold on. Repels. We're going to need these. I'll get 14 of them. Yeah, you! Yeah. Alright. We are for sure ready for this gym. I think. Alright. Give not to a cherry's berries. So, if she's a stun spore, we can at least avoid the uh, first one. Let's go. Let's get it. Let's do this. Let's have a good time. You kept me waiting. The turn of gym leader, Gardenia, the grass type master. When I first saw you, I was convinced you'd find your way to me. My hunch was right on the money. You have a winning aura about you. So, anyways, let's. So, anyways, this will be fun. Let's have our battle. I read Let's way before I read what the finish of the first sentence was supposed to be. I'm so excited! I'm too pumped! Let's go! Alright, and the leader starts off with a church wig. We're gonna go ahead and go with the Ember attack. Does good damage, but not enough. Turtwig gets up a reflect, boosting the physical attack of the team. Boosting the physical defense of their team. But Natsu is using Ember, a special attack fire type move anyway. Alright, it's time for Cherum to come out now. The evolution of Memberberry. Uh, we're going to go ahead and use Ember on it as well. Jerem goes for the magical leap. Hashtag 420. Hashtag Pokey High. But it does not very much as we go for another Ember attack. And, or Natsu goes for another Ember attack. But Cherum survives the second hit and goes for magical leap once again. Natsu doesn't take much damage, but we'll try to finish off Cherum with an Ember. But Cherum uses a potion. It seems to have lived one more hit, but at the health, Ember might take it down from here. And Cherum goes down. The evolution of Ember Berry is not good enough. Roserade is finally coming in. Will Joe switch? No, he is relying on Natsu to finish this battle. It's not the end yet. Yeah, it is. All right. Uh, Roserade goes for a Stun Spore. Oh no, Natsu's gonna be paralyzed. But, it looks like Natsu's chewing on a Cherry Berry. So, it is not gonna be paralyzed anymore. And Natsu goes for a Smoke Screen. Looking to lower the accuracy of that Roserade. Uh, Roserade goes for Stun Spore once again. But misses due to the Smoke Screen more than likely. Takes an Ember and it's burned. What a great turn for Natsu there, getting the ev evasion and landing a fire, uh, or burn, sorry. Roserade goes for the magical leaf now, and with all that damage, can it survive a dragon rage coming from Natsu? It does not! Roserade goes down, and Natsu takes that battle mightily. As he finishes off at being level 23. And almost gaining level 24. Amazing, you are good. Aren't you? Yeah. I might have said it before, but you're really tough. 
Wasn't it hard for you to raise your Pokemon to be so good? Yeah, because two fucking ones are done. I guess that's a measure of how much you love your Pokemon. In recognition of that, I probably grant you this. Joe received the Forest Badge from Gardenia. With the Forest Badge, your Pokemon can use the hidden move cut outside of battle. Now that you have two badges, all Pokemon you receive in trades will obey you up to level 30. I've also got something else. It's a gift from me. Obtain TM-86. TM-86 contains the move Grass Knot. It's one of my favorite moves. The heavier the foe, the more damage this will cause them. Okay, and... Let's fucking go! Bye! Alright, so now, before we can continue on... Wait, can we continue on? Still a long time no see. You look puzzled. You wonder who I am? I'm Professor Rowan's assistant. Come a long way. Blah, blah, blah. Here, you've met 45 Pokemon. Oh, EXP share. Wonderful. I really needed that. You have talked way too much to just give me a goddamn item. I don't need your pity. But... Go ahead and heal up. Try to get everyone else to level 23. And we need to take on the galactic thing. And we need a bike before we can leave the city. So that sucks. We built this city. We built this city on rock and roll. Alright. So, not to can finally take a little break. I'm not going to use Holly just yet. I'm enjoying our water grass. Uh, water grass fire core. Um, I do need to put Geodude away as well. Bidoof is our HM slave, so that's what he's sticking around for. I do kind of want to add a still psychic type, though. So we'll add him to the party for now, but we're not really going to try to level it up just yet. So Barbara, I mean, not Barbara, um, Quaden is on the team finally. And let's see what we can teach our team. Go ahead and get Stealth Rocks. We could teach them to Quaden, so that'll help us uh, strategically. All right, so we got Hypnosis. Let's let's get rid of Imprison for Stealth Rocks. Okay, Quaid and learn Stealth Rocks. Let's see. Don't need those. Let's use Cut, though. We need to use it on our HM Slave here. I mean, we can learn Grass Knot, but not if uh, we don't have a move to replace something with. Um... I don't want to get rid of where you see just yet. Just in case it comes in handy. Yeah, stop trying to teach it. And I'm not going to give it to, to, to Bronze or to Quaden just yet. Alright, so Don's up front. Wonderful. Um, let's go actually explore the mansion first. Oh, you know what? Maybe there's some battles to do over here. Because I need the EXP right now.
Uh, oh, look at this. Trees. Raspberries. Raspberries. Blueberries or blueberries or blueberries with the case island. Cherry berries. Cherries berries. Two orange berries. Wonderful. Oh, you're collecting accessories? I got something for you. You obtained a big tree. <laughs> I already had one. Alright, well, it looks like no battles over here. But there's items. I found TM82 for Sleep Dog. Yo, found Silver Powder. Oh, it's Powder Man. Alright, well, that was semi useless. Come this way. Finger in your butt. Hiya! Were you intrigued by the rumors going around, too? You know, people talk about ghost Pokemon of the old chateau. I've been hearing rumors about it since the Sinister Woods, too. I should check it out myself, but going in there is... Well, you know, being that I'm a gym leader, I'm always busy. So since I'm so busy, I can't go in. It's not because I'm scared. So good luck with your investigation. Who said I was going in there? Fucking whore. I'm scared too. Alright, now we're not. We're going in. We going in. All right, Cricketot is our encounter here for the woods. All right, so football, go. I don't want to hit him and he have bite. All right, he goes growl. Pokeball. Stay in the ball. Yes! Alright, we got Cricketot. What should we nickname this little thing? Its legs are short. Whenever it stumbles, its stiff antenna clack with the xylophone-like sound. Interesting. So Gary from that one episode of Spongebob. You know what? Uh, shit. It's a girl! I was gonna say Gary. You wanna tell me the nickname this time? You got a nickname for the Cricket Tot? See, you know, watching. Okay. The little cricket looking thing. Jimmy? It's a girl. It's a girl cricket. Gemma? <laughs> I'm gonna go Gemma. Yeah, why not? Can't be Jiminy Cricket, so it's gonna be Gemma. From, uh, what's it called? What's that one show? What's that one show, people? You know the show. The biker gangs and all. Sons of Anarchy. There we go. Ooh, we could add a hoot hoot. Remember from Hargo Till Silver? It's on our champion team. Hoot hoot. Alright, the old chateau. The old shit show. Alright. Oh, we got ghastly on our first encounter. Bittersweet. We can't evolve it as much as I would like to. Well, 
water pole. Plus, I don't want two ghost weakness on the same team at the moment. Hit yourself. Alright, cool. Now I can throw a poke. Oh my god, don't hit yourself again, please. Let's go for the primer ball. Pokemon loves the primer ball. Right. Gasly was caught. Born from gases, anyone would faint if they engulfed its gaseous body, which contains poison. Interesting. Alright, let's go with... God dang it, it's a girl! I can't go Casper. Um, famous girl ghost. Oh, hold on. Let's see. Ghost. Ghost. Not first. Alright, we're gonna go with Molly. Uh, Demi Moore played Molly and Ghost. You know, that, that movie that's really old that everyone makes fun of. With the clay pottery scene. Alright, let's go ahead. Ooh. I think there's a specific thing we gotta do in here, but I don't remember. I don't remember what it was. Ah, oh, shit, now I gotta battle. Oh, there we go. Water pole, pole. Oh, curse, really? Gonna inflict major damage that way. Damn. That's gonna hurt. All right, I'm gonna spray repel now, so. Damn right, I'm a nerd. Or as you said it, nerd. Ooh, Don's level 18. She's legal. I mean, he's legal. Whatever. Um, Let's go ahead and use our repel. So we can explore without being bothered. I found a big pearl. Spooky in here. Ooh, we're getting it. All right, let's look at these. Already? Fell suck. So an old notebook, there's something scrawled in it. Something so peculiar should make off with the mother. The rest of the pages are blank. Okay, that's interesting. The old gateau. All right, none of those say anything. Pokemon Pal, Pokemon Handbook, adorable Pokemon. All right. These repels are gonna be the death of me, I'm telling you. Gotta hurry up and get some max repels. Oh shit. 
It's spooky in here. Found TM90 for substitute. Whoa, the little girl. Where'd she go? All right, that's creepy. Let's go back in here. Oh, look at that, the eyes glow. <laughs> okay. All right, let's get out of here. Get the rappel going. All right, no girl this time. But there is a TV on. Look at the eyes. It's following us. Ah Interesting. The TV, there appears to be a Pokemon inside. The Pokemon appears as if it wants to come out. Want to thump the TV? Go thump the TV set. Oh shit, what's going on? Oh, we're definitely using Rotom. All right, Bill, come out. All right, stun spore. Ah, oh, damn it, Bill. Now we're really not going to hit it. Ah, come on, get it, hit it, damn it, Bill. She's in uproar, we're confused, hit it. No, not yourself. This is going to be a problem. All right, Bill, you need a break free. It's been plenty of times. There we go, stun sport. Activate. All right, but now we got to heal. All right, so Bell is healed up. Beautiful. Rotom is no longer making a ruckus. Go to not to. Alright, that's not good, but all we gotta do is land one Dragon Rage. Thundershot. Come on, Dragon Rage. Hit, yeah, dude! There we go. That's what I needed. Alright. So, Rotom is paralyzed now. Let's go for a Pokeball. Great ball. Let's do this. Damn it! Really? A Great Ball didn't do it. You're still, you're fully paired. Alright, time to just chuck Pokeballs until we catch it. We catching this Rotom. There we go. Rotom was caught! Ooh! Plasma Pokemon. Yeah, we're gonna take Rotom. We're gonna nickname you... Ah, short circuit doesn't fit. Mm. 
All right, we're gonna nickname it Jumper. Because it jumps to my jumper cable, electricity. And also jumper because it jumps from one type of electronic to another. Alright, but we got a new Pokemon. Don't have access to it yet, but we have a new Pokemon. Dread Plate. Not full of Pokemon books and photo collections. I think we came on the right day, too. I think only Fridays Rotom pops up. bag hell go ahead and go down here go back to the wally oh you know what that's probably a better one i'll go ahead and change that nickname i'll change it to wally it appears as if it's glaring everything's staring at me in here man Peace. Welcome, welcome, everybody. How's this, how y'all doing today? The little girl is gone. But look, look at the eyes. Look at the eyes of this thing. Look, boom, gone. Eyes. Woohoo! It's creepy, creepy. All right, well, I'm out of here. I got, I came for what I came for. And that little girl was never to be found again. Creepy Pokemon, creepy. All right, so now we have another Gen 4 Pokemon on our team. So unlike other regions where we end up having like a major Gen 1 or team, we're doing good so far. I'm going to replace Quaden. Mainly because of the level, but also because I don't want two Pokemon a week to ghost type move. <clears throat> and Gem is going to go to the box. As much as I'd like to use a cricket tot, I don't have time for it. What's up, Christian? Welcome to the stream, man. Um, so this is our four Pokemon for now. And I think <clears throat> we can take Quick Claw from Dawn and give it the EXP share. Because she's gonna he's gonna kinda take a back seat now. We're gonna let Rotom take a little bit of an advantage. Because I mean, it's super effective against most Zubats and stuff in this in this place, so might as well. well. Welcome everyone to the stream. We are two badges deep. We're about to face our second uh Galactic Grunt. We just got TM46 for theft. We're rolling right now. We got Rotom. Hello. It is me. Me. Ha ha ha. I have startled you, yes. I am, after all, an officer of the International Police. It is only natural that I be a master of disguise. Now they all know you're not a cop anymore. Stupid. Incidentally. You are a first rate trainer. Of that, I am very aware. I therefore think you will be okay, but I must warn you to be careful anyway. Also, a word of advice. 
This building, it has two upstairs. One of them a trap, it must be. But the crooks of Team Galactic, they don't appear to be, uh, how should I say, smart. There should be an easy way to tell the stairs apart. Welcome to Team Galactic. Are you here to donate your Pokemon? What? Well, you're not. Then kindly get off our property. Well, do we have to bring the pain like we did with the cycle shop manager? No. Hey, fuck off, dude. I'm trying to leave. Okay, did we heal our team? No, we did not. Let's go do that first. Our team needs to be healed because we're about to fight the boss lady. How is everyone doing tonight though? I'm doing great. I actually did an hour on the treadmill. So I earned them tacos. Probably fucking gained like three times more of the calories though. So. Like, ooh, you did an hour on the treadmill. Should have done three, you badass. Oh, yeah, I know. Sorry. I'm sorry. We are acquiring Pokemon from a most astonishing undertaking. Your meddling won't be tolerated. Oh, yeah, guys. Don't forget to join my Facebook. It's in the link below. It's for the Zamora Gaming page. And... Once we reach 100 followers here, I'll be doing a giveaway there. It's going good, Christian. Like I said, I'm having a good night. Just taking down some Team Galactic runs here. And taking down, we are. Look at that. Alright, we got a Stunky. Go ahead and go for the good old thunder shock there. Screeching and do nothing. But we do not want to mess with the evolved form of Stunky because it's a dark type. I don't know if Stunky itself is a dark type, but either way. Uh, if it isn't, then it's a dark type I don't mind messing with. So sorry, sweetie. Team Galactic has no room for kitties. I'm not a kitty. I'm an adult. I'm six and a half years old. How's it going for you, though, Christian? You having a good time? You having a decent day? Thunder shock! And down goes Zubat. Slam ya. Well, slam ya. We finally have a ghost type. Stifle your bitch ass. Yeah, all you're gonna do is growl because you can't do anything else. You fake out fury swiping scratching bastard. <laughs> oh, wow. Oh yeah, that's right. He's all, he's the guy who's like, I can't see. Our objectives, uh, our objectives are incredible. Too incredible for me to understand. I'll fight blindly to defend them. Ha! <laughs> Get it? Blindly? He couldn't see us. And your intrusion won't be forgiven. It was a pun. Or it was a play on words. Either way. Here's a good one. Jump off. Go ahead and take out this crow gun. Go ahead and take out this trifling son of a bitch. And down you go. Crow gun is an amazing Pokemon though. Would love to use one myself, but not at the moment. 
Alright, let's get the fuck out of here. The fuck out of here. Team Galactic is working hard to find new energies, new resources for the future. Okay. Hey, I need all the XP I can get. Can you fight me? There we go. Fight me. I need the EP. Stay thirsty, my friends. Oh, yeah. Wow. Fantastic, Mr. Bombastic. All right, there we go. Drink has been made. Go ahead and thunder shot. Oh, hypnosis. Why do you have power to do that? You're a cat. Uh oh. Fan attack. That's super effective. Let's go ahead and go out to Dawn here. And I have pursuit. Wow. All right, so it's gonna growl again. Beautiful. And water pulse goes off, and we're good to go. Meow. Meow. Night, night, kitty. Okay. Get down, Barry. Beautiful. And using the regular potion. And we're good. Let's keep on moving. Let's keep on trucking. Oh, let's go over there first. So this is the one that has the Pokemon. Why, thank you. We love it when people come to us to donate their Pokemon. Yeah, buddy. I'm not in the donation style mood. Thundershock. Ooh, that does some good damage. Stunky is stunned. Stunky is like, what do I do, coach? And the grunt's like, I don't fucking know. It's a ghost type. And I'm just like, Thundershock, bitch. Ooh, Don, you're level 19. Beautiful. Once Don gets to level 20, I'll stop uh, using uh, EXP share. I want pretty much everyone to stay on the same basis of type. Uh, a level. Oh, it goes for pursuit, but we didn't switch out, so we're fine. Hi, I lost my ghastly the last time I played through this thing. And I was pissed because I was able to evolve that ghastly. Alright, so we got glam y'all again. Don't put me to sleep, please. And finally, an evil team that doesn't just use uh, Rattatas and Zubats. 
think this is the first one. I mean, other than, you know, the occasional Poochiana in Gen 3 or Tamara, but other than that, eh, it happened very often. It's still Zubat everywhere. And then in Gen 2, no one really had a Crobat. So it's like, eh. Kind of weak sauce, my guy. You're good, jumper. Keep it up. Our mission is to implement our operations without question. It is for all the New World Order and our boss will lead. Mm, sounds like Hitler to me. Oh, how I wish I had a dark type move. Let's go for Confuse Ray. Uh oh, X special. Hit yourself. Alright, let's go for the Thunder Shot. Decent chunk. Hit yourself. There you go. All right, hit yourself again. Do it, do it, do it, do it, do it! Damn it. This might not be good. Ooh. We did it. Oh boy. That was scary. I was like, I should have fucking healed. I should have fucking healed. I should have fucking healed. But no, we're fine. Jumper grew to level 21. Huh. That was almost a very scary. All right, so let's just use a super potion. That warrants a good one. Ooh, don't want to lose jumper so soon. We just got him, baby. Ordinary people like you can't under understand Team Galactic's grand design. I would think of it. I don't even know what's going on. Yep. Aw. That's the wrong one. He's defending nothing. Where did I already beat that grunt? Ah, I'm slipping. Slipping, slipping, slipping into the future. Alright, so we gotta revive, but it's not really gonna help us any. Alright, so. Let's go ahead and put Nacho up front, you know what I'm saying? Because <sighs> this stunky is not going to be easy. Yo, j Dog, welcome to the stream. We only have one new casualty. It was Weasel. Um, we got through the first lady pretty well. Then we beat the gym, no problem. And now we're here. Ready to destroy this lady's team. What is with this Team Galactic? Why did they take our Pokemon? What are they trying to accomplish? I don't know, dude, but I'm going to take this item and leave. So, good luck with whatever fucking problem you got, but I'm not. Just kidding. Working for World Peace, Team Galactic. Or World Domination. Eh? Did you want something? How silly of me to even ask. You want to free the Pokemon? Fine. I'm Jupiter. We'll deal with you. Okay. Commander Jupiter sent out Zubat. Oops, sorry. Alright, so I'm gonna go to Jumper here. Didn't... I didn't think she'd have only one Pokemon, but... I sent it out just to be sure. Alright, so Thundershock on the Zubat will take care of that thing. Ooh, or not. Uh oh. No. Fuck, there. How insolent. Take a bite out of this child. Fuck your Zubat. Alright, every time I see a dark time move on Jumper, I'm gonna get nervous. I know it's bulky, but still, come on. 
All right, Jupiter's gonna send out Skunk Tank. Let's do it. Not to, it's your time to shine. An illegal Skunk Tank. Look at this thing. Level 23. All right, let's go ahead and go for Dragon Rage. And I'm loving this move because two, two Dragon Rages normally takes care of everything. All right, it pissed on us some poison gas, which is horribly disgusting. Why would you do that? And this dragon raid should take it out. Oh, it lives on one? Oh, that's horse shit. Don't you dare. Mm. Nope, nope, nope. Okay. Whew. I prayed to Jesus right there because Night Slash has a high critical hit chance. Oh! Gunk Take is gone though. So, none to worry. Even though I was fucking worried. But we're fine. Losing to some child. Being careless cost me too much. Well, I'm too tough. It's okay. Though. Our official Pokemon statue investigation is finished. Mars collected energy from the Valley Windwork. We're pretty much finished here. I'll let you in on one little thing. Our boss is researching the myths of ancient Pokemon. With the power of the mythical Pokemon, he will become the ruler of Sinnoh. I suggest you keep out of Team Galactic's affairs from now on. This is your last warning. Shut up, Rod. Uh, I got my Clefairy back. It's all thanks to you. But that Team Galactic, they said Clefairy came from space, handed over. Their logic baffles me. It's like they're, they are from space. Anyway, you've gone now. They're gone now. Thank you so very much. I can't thank you enough right now, but cruise by my cycle shop, okay? Gotcha, fam. My homeboy's gonna hook me up with a whip, nah, I mean? I don't even know what I mean. Hmm. Alright, everyone cleared out. Time for us to cut this tree down and not get interrupted on our way to the Pokemon Center. Oh, I thought I was going to get interrupted. Well, it goes to show. I don't know everything about this game. But... Thank you for waiting. We've restored your Pokemon to full health. We hope to see you again. Okay. Oh, shit. Now we're going to get interrupted. Oh, there you are. I was looking for you. I've got something nice. I wanted you to have this Pokemon egg. Will you accept it? Yes. That's wonderful. The Pokemon inside the egg is happy, too. I'm sure of it. Keep the egg with you in your party of Pokemon. A Pokemon will hatch from it while you are traveling. It. I would be happy to know what it will help. Rewind. I will be happy to know that it will help fill your, another page in your Pokedex. See you again. I had a seizure or a stroke mid-sentence and I just could not finish what I was trying to read. Thanks for rescuing me. This is something to show you my thing. It's the latest model. Bicycle. You must take it. I insist. Uh, well, okay. I'm, I'm going to take it. It's the latest model. So I'll read the operation manual. You press B to shift gears and then you're good to go. All right. Thank you. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go again. Getting a bike from my good friend. Bicycle, I want to ride my bicycle. I don't know what you're talking about, lady.
All right, so we got plenty of battles to do now. All right, so Don, you don't need that anymore. Bell, go ahead and get up front, gain you some levels. We got a lot of battles to do. We need to get everyone, hopefully, to level 25 before we enter the cave. We got you. We got Mega Drain. It doesn't help that, uh. I mean, most of our Pokemon could have been fine already with levels, but I use so many levels on, uh. What do you call it? Weasel. And then uh, he ended up not living long enough to be useful. So, that hurt. That hurt my team. But, there's plenty of bicycle battlers to do. Double team once again. Pikachu, you're about to go down. Oh, fuck! Stop missing Bell! Oh, by the way, we fixed Bell's name. We added the E to the end of Bell. So, it's a Bell. Finally hits this Pikachu with the plus two evasion. And let's keep it going from here. Alright. That did not stop. Holy shit. Uh, let's see, do we have paralyzed heals? Yes, we do. What the hell? It was just paralyzed, right? Maybe natural cure fixed it. That's weird. I didn't know it happened like that. Cycling feels great. It will feel even better when I beat you in a battle. Well, if natural cure, yeah, natural cure works that way, then that's awesome. Alright, so Staravia is here, so we're gonna obviously have to switch. We're gonna go to um, Rotom. Or Jumper. Oh, I was supposed to change his nickname too to Wally. Almost takes out the Staravia with one hit, and Wing Attack comes off, but it does not do nearly enough thanks to our electric typing. And funny enough, in Gen 4, no matter what appliance you are, you will always be Ghost Electric. Because now, if you're like the washing machine or something, you will be uh, Electric Water. Or if you're the oven, you're electric fire. Or if you're the lawnmower, you're electric grass. Or, yeah, that's pretty much it. Um, what was I going to say? Oh, yeah. In Gen 4, it doesn't matter. Whatever you are, you're still, you're still electric ghost. But you do get that move still. What was I doing? Oh, yeah. Name. Name Raider. Oh, y'all doing that? Wally. There we go. Wally is the nickname. Alright, let's see. Um, Gym 3. Platinum Gym Leaders. Alright, so the third one's level 26. We gotta be careful too, because she got Miss Magius. And Miss Magius is a bitch!
Okay. So let's get started. Level 26, baby. Here we go. Really? Can't just generate me on my bicycle like Gen 1? So how many new casuals, cheese do we have? None now. I've already updated the list. Ding, ding. Watch out. You or did you want to battle? Ah, battle, please. It's a bell. Uh oh, and it's a ponyta, so we're gonna go ahead and switch right out to Dawn. Sadly, Dawn is only a uh, water type right now, so only a one single resist to uh, Ponyta's move. Go ahead and get this water pulse off. Dawn used water pulse. Kill it. Kill it with water. Shit. Alright, well, we're gonna have to switch back out. Let's go and go to Wally here. Walla Walla Wally Pants. Jesus Christ. Oh, now it goes for Flame Wheel. What a douchebag. Thundershot. Now I gotta go heal. Oh no. Oh, that scared me. Thought it was gonna land a crit. I'm so scared of crits right now. All right, so let's go heal. Did anyone used to do that as a kid? When they had their bite, they put it like in the lowest gear, so you'd have to like to even go. And then while you were doing it, you just went and it fucking cinched all the way to that smallest gear. Like, hey, no, but that small gear that you have on your bike, so it's just like, and you just take off. That shit was fun. Popped my chain a couple times doing that, but you know, stupid kids with no internet. What are you gonna do? Ring, ring. I never had a bell on my bike either. Wait, did I? I think I did one actually and i fucking ring the fucking shit out of it i was like ring 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 everyone knew i was coming starly come on man Wally. At least she has a few Pokemon this time around. So we can go ahead and get a Thunder Shock here and see what else she throws out now. Really Charlie. Come on, man. I'm trying to train up my grass type here. It's like the the world wants me just to train up Wally only. All right, Thunder Shark, it is another Starly. Ooh, this one level nineteen. All right. Oh, jeez, I seem to have fallen off my bike. What? That bike you got there, it's got types of gear. The, uh, it's got the type that can change gears. You gotta love that. Sure, I'll give you a battle. Cool story, bro. Fuck. 
another starling. What the fuck is wrong with you people? Do all you have is freaking flying type? Go to Wally. Wally, Wally, Wally World. Wally, Wally, Wally World. Wally, Wally World. All right, it's thunder shot time. Thunder shot time. Ugh, Staravia. Come on. I need something grass type Pokemon can take out. Out of the shit. They're holding out on me. I know it. Thunder Shock. Hmm. Staravia goes down, 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 down. Ooh, Wally wants to learn Shockwave? You damn right. Better than Thundershock, and it never missed. So fuck your double teams, people. We're coming. The future is here. Crash Tangle. A bike will carry you a long way. The only thing that limits you is your own endurance. This man calling me fat. He said you ain't going nowhere, fat ass. Damn right, I ain't got a bike. My bike, my bike riding days are over. Well, not over, but shit, not to go everywhere. I do not mind using gas. I used to ride a bike to work every day when I was 18. And I would go all the way from one side of Burbank all the way to the other where I live. And fuck that, dude. That was a long ride. It was like a 15 minute bike ride. So imagine how many miles that was. And most of it was uphill. So I was just like, oh my fucking face. It's dying. And then I'd walk all day. And then I had to ride my bike all the way back home no, was, was not a good time some people compete over speed and some people compete over technique what kind are you speed ah. <laughs> oh i hurt my back Ugh. i guess i'm not I, I'm not speed. I'm just kidding. I'm not speed at all. I'm not alive in a minute if I keep this shit up. Good or not to. Flame wheel. Couldn't afford taking a stomp. Cheat code. Gone, Ponyta. Alright, Natu is level 24. Beautiful. One more level. And you're the level where I want you to be at. And then I need to get you one more level because the gym leader's level 26. So I need to get everyone level 26. Um, let's go ahead and make a drain. Yeah, you. Yeah. That's fine. You're dead now. Bye bye, Shinx. I'm really hoping to get a guard chomp soon. I've already caught a Jill dude. I already caught a bronze ore. I already caught uh, the, 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 the Zubat. So, how many other encounters can there be in that cave? 
Hopefully it's not a fucking chain link. If it's a chain link, I'm throwing my controller across the screen. Then we go. Bell, you ain't got time to be paralyzed. You ain't got time to be paralyzed. Yes. Pikachu goes down. Cheers. Bell gets to 369. And um, that's all the bikers that we can battle. Ooh, I got the flag accessory. Oh shit, I can't do that. I wish. Come on, I want I want to use the flag. I remember a long time ago you put the flag on the bike and you got a little flag on your bike. Woohoo! Everyone knows where you are because of the flag. Alright. So we gotta watch out for some of these motherfuckers over here. Because they got some fucking tricky ass shit up their sleeve. But, we're gonna go ahead and come this way first. No, oh, hold on. What route is this? 207, 206. 206, we don't have a Pokemon. So, time for a new encounter. Ponyta! Pokemon we could have had, but fainted. Alright, Don, your time to shine, baby. Welcome, welcome to the stream, everybody. Alright, so we have Hidden Power. We're going to use Hidden Power. It is Hidden Power Rock, but it's our weakest move. Alright, perfect. Now time to start chucking Pokeballs. What should we name Ponyta? And also, guys, welcome to the stream. Hopefully, you're having a fantastic night. It is Friday, so I know most people are relaxing and chilling from a long week of work. So, cheers to that. Um, now, what do we nickname this thing? Uh, Bar Horse. Nope, not that. Um, it's a girl ponyta. What's a girl horse name? You know what? Um, I'll give you a few more seconds. 
And if y'all don't want to name it, I'll nickname it something. Ding dong, ding dong, ding dong, ding dong, ding 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 dong. All right, for the time being, I will just go with the nickname Flannery. Unless y'all got something better, I'll go ahead and switch it up real quick. We already know where the name raider is. Alright, so a backup fire type. Our first item is Burn Hill. This is odd. I heard there were two caves on Route 206, but I can only find one entrance. Oh, looks like you're shit out of luck. Rossberries, pick them up. Yeah. <clears throat> Ross, help with burn. Geo Jude. Also, guys, don't forget tomorrow we have the PML Draft. 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 Uh, at noon central time texas time ooh super bell we can actually start using repels too because we already got our encounter super repel time and here is a ground type user, so beautiful. Onyx! Gone, baby! That was a critical hit, too. Sucks to suck, my guy. <clears throat> and now Onyx again. And Bell will finally be level 23. And then we can start uh, training up somebody else, too. Mm -hmm. Onyx goes down, down, down. Alright, so Bell gets level 23. And we can go ahead and switch... Um, on because she's falling behind she's quickly falling behind on levels all right we got poison bob so that's gonna help uh that's gonna help badu once it evolves So, Slash is a regular TM move, so we can teach it to whoever. Teach it to Wally. Um, double team is basically the same thing as Flash, so I'm going to go with Flash. Alright. This is where we can catch... Uh, Gibble. I don't remember exactly what part. I just know we can catch a Gibble here. Alright, so let's go ahead and use another repel. Alright, so we got Quick Claw. Let's give it to Dawn. Who's making really good use of it. Um... Poison Barb. Oh no, yeah. No. Yeah, I guess the rest can wait. Um. 
that's it. Let's go ahead and find our way through this little maze. So that's what it is. It's a maze. Okay. Oh, this is going to be annoying. Repel. Alright, let's backtrack a little. We already have that. So leave us alone. Wandering around, I got hungry, so I ate some wild mushrooms. They gave me gas, and now I can't stop burping. Interesting. You are challenged by Hiker Lorenzo. Sent out Onyx. That's fine. That's beautiful. That's perfect, actually. Give me all the ground types you can give me. Rage. So I need to see my clipboard. I got the map pulled up. So I can't see the chat right now. I need the map. This cave can get very confusing. I mean, this is my first time going through it on my own. And I've never been through this cave before. And that's why I'm always really under leveled when I get to the next gym. Because I always get to the next gym, I always be like, why am I so underleveled? Like, did I miss something? And all my life, I did. I miss this. Here she goes bottom left and upper left. And I go all the way to the right, down, right. Down, right, down, right, down, right, up, right, or left. And I need to find a little girl, too. Don grew to level 21. I'm going to avoid these double battles if I can. Did you come play with two? Want to play with me? That's kind of sus, my guy. All right, so now I can see the chat and the map. Cool. Welcome back, Christian. We're going through the Wayward Cave right now under the bike bike path. And like I said, just in time because I can see the chat now.
All right, so Don's taking a beating from this Doravia, but we're getting the upper hand. <clears throat> All right, Ponyta's coming out. We're going to stay in and heal up. Super Potion time. <clears throat> Ponyta goes for the Tail Whip. Defense falls, but we should be fine. Let's go for the Water, water Pulse here. Quick claw, any time now. Like right now would be great. Hit yourself, hit yourself, hit yourself, hit yourself, hit yourself. Hit yourself. Fuck. Okay, well that's not as bad. Critical hit, but not very effective. Now if you would have stomped crit me, I would have been crying right now. Alright, so down goes Ponyta and 650 EXP goes to me. All right, Bill, I need you to gain a level and evolve. You've had the Soothe Bell for well long enough since the beginning of the stream. Um, I need you to be friendly enough already. Mega Drain! I started playing Sinnoh yesterday. So yesterday was the first episode. Today is the second episode. I played three hours yesterday, and I'm almost at three hours today. I want to finish the cave today, though. So until we catch us as a gibble and get out of this cave, that's uh, when uh, we'll be done to, for, with the stream. Alright, hush now, lost little Pokemon. Don't you cry. I'm here to take care of you. That's creepy. Is there a wild Hypno in this cave? Alright, Water Pulse time. Goes for the Endure, so at least we get a free hit. That did nothing. What the hell? Go for Mud Bomb. And here he goes for Foresight. And Mud Bomb does a lot more. Oh, we'll get to crit. That's why. And his accuracy fell too. So let's go for Mud Bomb again. Quick Claw finally pops off once again. And another crit. Down goes Baneri. But Neri didn't stand a chance. And Dawn is finally level 22. Again, Dawn evolves at level 30. So, still got a ways to go. Alright, Player Cassidy. Uh, whatever. <clears throat> rock Smash Rock. We're going to break it. Alright, TM32 Double Team. So, if uh, we really need Double Team, we can always get it back on. Alright, I'm going to really try to go for this Gibble now. We already caught a Jill, dude, so this dupes. Alright, Mud Bomb, take out this Jill, dude. Oh, I live. Magnitude 9, fuck off. There we go. It did enough. Alright, now I'm going to go ahead and put a potion. And one more. So super potion for not to. 
Let's go ahead and get another potion for Wally here. Let's keep the team healthy. Because when we don't is when we have problems. We already have a bronze on too, so we don't need that. And I'm not gonna waste time on wild Pokemon anymore. Because we need our PP for uh, wild encounter, uh, not wild encounter, uh, for trainer battles. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and run off from here. Work our way up this way. I'm just waiting for the Gibble. Once we get the Gibble, I'm going to put the Repels back up. We already have a Zubat, too. My heart sank for a minute. I was like, no! Oh, but we don't have an Onyx. Fuck! <sighs> it looks like we're going to catch ourselves an Onyx. Mud Bomb. Let's go. Fucking shit, dude. I wanted a gibble. Now we can't get a gibble all the way until... Um, what do you call it? All the way until Victory Road. Fuck you, Onyx. I'm not even going to give him a cool nickname. I'm just going to call you Snake. That's it. Snack. Not even Snake. Just Snack. Stupid ass fucking Pokemon. Popping up when I could have had a Gibble. Whatever. Watch. Next encounter is going to be a Gibble. Where am I? Am I lost? Who are you? Are you a Pokemon trainer? Uh, you're battling me, so I guess so. It's too late now. Alright, Psyduck. I can't kill this thing with easy hits, so let's go to Bell. It's going to take too long to take that thing down and chip it down with special moves. Well, special moves that the other Pokemon had. So Mega Drain, let's go. One shot, one shot, one shot, one shot, one. No kill. Okay. It takes two. Or Jesus Christ, and then it would disable me. Fuck you, Psyduck. Can anything else happen wrong? Don't. No. Never mind. I didn't say that out loud. Uh, Ether for my Mega Drain. All right, no longer disabled. Beautiful. Mega Drain. And down goes Psyduck. All right, here we go. Now, look, next up. Watch, Gibble. Okay. <laughs> I guess I'm not so upset then. But fuck, dude, I wanted a gibble. So bad. Bag, super repel. Or repel. Whatever. Whatever I have. <clears throat> you, you're lost, aren't you? I'll guide you if you can beat me. I don't need your help. All right, Apom. <clears throat> Take this mud bomb to the face. Okay, or not. Water pulse time. 
<clears throat> that did better. Quick claw again. <clears throat> Water bolts. Confusion and then hit yourself. Hit yourself. Ah, oh, damn it. Almost called it. Not that confusion already. Son of a bitch. Well, water pulse it is. I'm not lost. I'll tell you I'm camping. That's my story. Please stick to it. Stupid. Talk shit to me. Oh, Gibble. Oh, Gibble. Go for our cell, Gibble. How I want thee. Cool, we got an escape room. Okay. So we could go... And we'll go to the right. We have a super appeal, right? Let's do that. We can. All right, so that's a shortcut. Huh? Are you lost too? No, it doesn't matter. Let's have a quick battle. Camper Parker sent Weasel out. Oh, yeah. Fucking nice, dude. Just sending out the Pokemon I lost. Bastard. You knew, didn't you? You knew it would hurt me. Mega Drain. I'm really hoping Bill evolves on this level. Interesting. Oh yeah, Don's not ground type yet, so Shanks, no. Stay away. Mega drain. Mega drain like we want to. Of course it's two AKO. Ah. Run like the wind, run like the wind. Yeah. 256 almost. One more battle and he'll get the job there. Alright, super potion, uh, regular potion actually, my last one. Should be fine. But every good picnic needs is a cute setting, good fun, and a fun battle. Hoot hoot. Hidden power. And the boost. Dong. Oh, dead. Good. Bye. Shit! Three hit KO. Are you kidding me right now? <sighs> I guess who who got the skills to pay the bills, not me. Just hit him, dude. All that extra shit you're doing. 
Very unnecessary. There we go. That's what I want to see right there. Ah, oh, shit. Okay, that, that explains that. Well, you have to go this way. Alright, we're almost to the little girl. And then we can hopefully find our way out of this soon. You look like you might just have the Pokemon I've been looking for. What the hell are you talking about, dude? You ain't stealing my Pokemon. Collector Terry. Oh, why do you have it? You're right, bastard. Not fair. I wanted the Gibble. Critical hit. Hit yourself. Hit yourself. Hit yourself. Hit yourself. Because I know you're going to go for Dragon Rage. Good. Get the fuck out of my face. Bitch ass monkey. You over there having yourself a Gibble and I don't have one. You didn't have a single Pokemon I was looking for. In deep tunnels and caves, there are a couple of things you're sure to see. Zubat and Ruin Maniacs. Well, that's a good thing, because that means you have a Rock-type Pokemon, right? Yes! Thank you! Come again! Thank you! Come again! Alright, Bronzor! Oh, let's go ahead and just send out not to. I ain't got time for this shit, boy. I mean, I do. I have all night, but. Figure speech, you know what I meant. Ember is a two hit kill. Can we break through the confusion? Why must you confuse me? You stupid Bronzor. Uh... How's it going, Chris, man? There we go. Now we are asleep. Two, man, two. Excuse me, by the way. Burping all over the place. Big mistake. Kicking your ass all over the place. Wake up. Hit him. In this. Son of a bitch! Alright, I ain't got time for this, dude. Super potion. Don't hit yourself again, Charmeleon. I swear to God. Bronzor, I'm going to wait until you fall asleep, and then I'm going to put a pillow right over your face and fucking smother you. Stop putting my Pokemon to sleep. Who are you, Bill Cosby? All right, so Bronzor used the sensor, and hopefully we can finally destroy this thing with the scratch. Don't hit yourself. <sighs> D 
get get over it, Stannis Trouble! You fucking shithead! I'm trying to end this battle, please. One fucking HP, and he's gonna live for like 80 turns. Stupid fucking Pokemon. Oh yeah, pretty music. Stupid ass. Get in the battle a whole fucking ass time ago if you didn't stop fucking hitting yourself. Okay. <sighs> We're calm now. Alright, let's go ahead. Blue shard. Beautiful. That's the only fucking surprise we're waiting for. Wow. Game is ass. There we go. See, that repel took a while. Fuck. Repel. Spray eight of them. I don't need to repel. I don't need to see Pokemon for a while. I'm Mira. I was catching Pokemon and then I got lost. I'm so scared. Please take me to the exit. Okay. We have Mira and we're taking her to the exit. So it was this way. This way. Down, left, up, left, 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 hoopla, dude, I literally took like 10 steps, hoopla, hoopla, down, Oh, there's the exit. I want to get tougher so I can't, so I won't be such a scaredy cat. So, bye bye. Thank you. All right. Cool. We're out of here. Apparently, there's more entrances, but I don't know. Okay. So there's a second entrance on route 206. What the fuck? We're, we're on 206. See. The Wayward Cave, the two story cave in Sinnoh, uh, Flash or Navigate uh, 206 beneath. There's a side quest inside the cave where the player does the NPC, whatever. There's a hidden, si hidden entrance directly under Cycling Road west of Main. Wayward cave entrance. The cave is notably the only habitat of wild Gibble and Sinnoh. And strength is required to get into that area, but not in Platinum. Okay. So Gibble's not in this area. It's... Oh, Gibble's here. Okay, so we're getting a Gibble. This is a, this is a completely different area. Hey, Eddie, shut your goddamn whore mouth. But yes, you're right. There is. <laughs> there is one death today. It was Weasel. But we get to use Dawn now, so it's fine. Uh, let's see. 
All right, so let's go ahead and get us our gibble because I'm getting a gibble. Oh yeah, need to use flash. This is a completely different area, so I'm counting it. So if we find Gibble in here, I'm, I'm catching it. There's a different area, hidden area, no one knows about it. Unless you have the game informer like I never did. But it seems to be the rare encounter, so we got to try and catch it. The gibble. I want the gibble now. I mean, we already have every other encounter possible. Jill, do Zubat, Onyx, Bronzor. We already have them all. We we found them in other place, other caves. So, the only last encounter I could possibly get is Gibble, and I'm going to get it, eventually. I just got to run around until I get one. Hey, the, it's a separate area in the game. It counts. It's not original Wayward Cave. It's a different Wayward Cave. It's a different area, so it counts as a different encounter. All right, I'm going to need a repel for this shit, because I need it. Give me a gibble, damn it! This game does not like me at all. I'm not eating. I'm not ending. I'm not ending stream today until I have a gibble in my possession. Watch, we're gonna get a shiny before you get a freaking gibble. But how you doing, Eddie? You at work or you you finally got time off? This better be a fucking gibble. It stopped me mid jump. God damn it, you fucking bronze on piece of shit. Dude, what the fuck? Yes! Never mind. I'm okay with this. Don't kill it, Don. Oh, you're at work. Do you ever get a day off, man? I don't know if you noticed, but you're our rival in this game. Ooh, okay. Sandstorm, that's fine. Alright, so let's go ahead and get Bell in here. Whew. We're catching this song, bitch. Sunspore, hit it. Come on, dude. It's one sand attack.
Uh, this is the first scene of this playthrough. All right, man. Well, a little catch up. Um, we were playing yesterday. We just started yesterday. Oh, ooh, sandstorm subsided. Thank God. We just started yesterday, so we did all of our stuff. We lost one Pokemon yesterday. And uh, it was an early death due to a crit, of course. So no surprise there. I have off the next two days after I get off. I have worked eight days in a row and I'm exhausted. Oh, I'm not ready for those days. But, um, yeah, we did that. Everyone voted for Chimchar to be our starter. So he's sitting in the box. Starly died to a crit. We finally got a gibble. <laughs> Sharknado is back. All right, so we have Sharknado on the team. I'm nicknaming this one. Screw you guys, I'm giving him. Um. Okay, so. Oh, hold on. Before we lost our Pokemon. Sharknado. Before we lost our Pokemon to a crit, we beat the gym with Badoo. The first gym. Then that's when we lost our Pokemon to Team Galactic on a crit from Stunky. And then we uh sorry, I'm trying to concentrate at the same time. Grip claw! Oh we get a sneeze though, it's over. Um, then we, what do we do next? Oh, we had Siega already. Then after that, we did the Valley Woodwork stuff. We caught a Buizel, and I was afraid to battle at the end of stream, <clears throat> because our, our Pokemon were like level 16. Um, go ahead and give me some ideas for the nickname for this, guys, while I continue with my story. <clears throat> Uh, so I decided to end stream. We grinded our, po I grinded my Pokemon off screen. Got everyone level 18 except Buizel. It was like level 14. And there's no EXP boost in this game. So it was kind of a pain in the ass. And then, um, started stream today. Beater, no problem. Well, a little problem, but you know, no, we couldn't handle no death. Then we went through the forest. We got our encounter later. We got a cricket tot. We got Rotom. Then, uh. I just did all this shit right now. Before you join. Uh, then we did the Gardenia thing. Caught some Pokemon. Uh. Caught Bronzong. That's why I didn't need Bronzong here. Caught Ponyta just now. Been leveling up Pokemon. Took out the Team Galactic team from their base. And yeah, that's pretty much it. We're all caught up now. We got ourselves a Gibble and I'm happy as fuck. And then we have Togepi that we could evolve into a Toga Kiss if we wanted to. But I really don't want to. Um and no one's giving me a nickname, guys. Come on. Get, put, put a nickname in the chat. Don't make me nickname this thing Rick. I don't know why Rick, but Rick. Yeah, I got till I finish making my drink. Yeah. But yeah, guys, today has been a good day. I, like I said, I ate some, I ate some pho. And then 
I ate some tacos. And then I streamed. I did an hour on the treadmill. Eggman, that worked for me. I did an hour on the treadmill. Uh, killing it. Killing it today. Well, killing my treadmill hour because tacos and drinking ain't helping it. <laughs> but. Oh, thank you, Amber. I'm finally not being a fat ass today. Cleaned up a little bit more. Did some stuff. Enjoyed my day. Took a shower after the workout, which is the most important thing, because I didn't want to stink from my own house. Reese's, the candy. So Reese's. I think it's two E's. I don't know. I don't eat Reese's, so. I think it's that. Let me see. Let me Google it real quick. Before I look like a goddamn fool. Oh, yeah. I'm right. Reese's peanut butter cups. I spelt it correctly, surprisingly. Because I'm a fat fuck. What fat person doesn't know how to spell Reese's? All right, repel. Damn it. No. Oh, rare candy. Yes, that that was worth going back for. I know that. I'm telling you, man. If it's not food, I don't know how to spell it, right? All right, uh, let's continue on this way. And there's a little sneak peek thing right here. Earthquake! We got TM26 for Earthquake! Oh, happy fucking day. Hell yeah, I'll take Earthquake. You know what? This lock, this lock is going to be okay. We're going to be just fine. Look at that. Almost the perfect amount of repels to get the fuck out of here. We got us a Gibble. We got TM26 for Earthquake. It is a good fucking day. You know what? Let's let's do a few more battles. Get to the next cave and uh, see what happens from there. It's Friday night. Uh, I need to go heal my Pokemon Friday night. Alright, Samantha, be the good slave that you are and cut that tree down. Um, Let's go in here. Get our team sorted. Because you damn right I'm adding Garchomp to the team right now. I'll take your Pokemon for a few seconds. Better give him back. I just got that gibble. All right. But Amber, how are you doing today? Uh, let's see. Let's go ahead and put you away. All right. So there's only one negative to putting Sharknado to our team. And that's double ground. But I don't care. <laughs> I have never been able to have a guard chomp on my team in this playthrough. Tipsy and food, you good? That's good. What kind of food? Uh we just need to evolve Badoo. We need to I mean Rotom doesn't need to evolve, it's Rotom. We need to get Don to level 30 to evolve. We need Sharknado to get to, I think. I don't even know. Um, 
not to gain evolve into level 36, but everyone needs to be level 26 by the next gym battle. So this is our live box, and this is our death box. We've lost Sarah and Jetski. But in the PC, we have Barbara, Mike, Grapes, Jack, Molly, Holly. Hey, right next to each other. Reese's, uh, Snick, Flannery, Gemma, Quaden, and Loretta. Food, don't worry about it. That's rude. Just ask the question. <laughs> Batman just wants to know. Um... Well, let's go ahead and get these battles done over here. Oh, no. All right. So let's go ahead and get the EXP share on this boy. Let's go ahead and do the double battle. Why not? Also, guys, don't forget to join me on Facebook. Once we get 100 followers here, I'll be doing a giveaway there on some more gaming. So invite your friends, invite your family, invite your significant others, invite your side hoes and side dudes. I don't care. Just bring them to the stream. All right, so this is not good. Don should not be here. So we're going to go to Wally. And we're going to go ahead and Dragon Rage Pachirisu here. Ooh, Chinese food. Oh, I love Chinese food. Well, depends on where you get it from. Uh, I like Walk It. Walk It, some really good food. So pricey, though. And Skillman Walk is good. Oh, yeah, that was my dad's favorite. Skillman Walk, he liked the egg drop soup. I always just got the combination fried rice without shrimp. Uh, but yeah, I don't care for shrimp. Let's go ahead and Ember Pachirisu and get the shockwave off on Chimchar. Ah, Wally's paralyzed. That's ridiculous. <clears throat> Oh, don't worry. I'm coming to kick your ass. I need to get some more potions. Now that I think about it. Man, Pachiritsu is just fucking paralyzing everybody. Gonna need wheelchairs after this one. <laughs> Excuse me. Oh, we lost. Yeah, you did. Alright, do I have Paralyzed Heals? Yes, I do. Fantastic. Super Potion. Just what I needed. All right, everyone's all healed up and ready to go. All right, I just got through Mount Cornet, but I still got a lot of energy to burn. All right, go talk to your wife about that. Leave me alone. I'm just a kid. So, Jill, dude, is at level 20. Don's at level 23. Let's see how this fares. So Water Pulse takes down the Geo Dude. Yes. Um. Anyone 
watch any good shows lately. I've been watching The Legend of Korra and um, really liking it. Me and my wife been watching White Collar again. That's my favorite show, probably of all time. And it's just all the puzzles in it. it keeps you engaged the whole way through. It's amazing. The Selena series on Netflix. Oh, okay. All right. How's that? I haven't watched it. I'm sure my sister's watched it. She's a huge Selena fan. Very good. Who's the actress in it? Isn't it, uh, 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 look, I can't remember names. Scarlett Johansson? Isn't she playing the black, isn't she playing Selena in those things? No? I thought, wasn't there a rumor that she was going to? I don't know. I don't know things. I just regurgitate what I see on the internet. Look, Weasel! Alright, Mud Bomb. Ay, como me duele. Alright, Weasel's gonna take a two shot Mud Bomb. Don't ask me to sing the rest. I don't really know the words in Spanish. I mumble them, but I don't know them for sure. I could be wrong. Oh, I should have switched. Alright, let's see. Sharknado, you ready? Throwing them to the wolves. Or the gatos. Yeah, fuck you, Dragon Rage. Fuck you! I'm suction cut man. Yeah, Luxio had nothing. Nothing! For Sharknado. Look at this beautiful boy. He's a little chubby wubby. He's my favorite! He's gonna help us win it all. I'm telling you right now. Torque, NATO, 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 NATO. Alright, the Ligar's coming in, so now we can go back to dawn. To the dawn of time. Alright, Water Pulse. Water Pulse, eh? Hey, get your Water Pulse, eh? Hey. Well, how's everyone else who's too shy to comment in the chat doing? I want to know how y'all's day was. Good? Bad? Okay? Let me know. I can help you feel good. By showing you some Pokemon. Alright, Sharknado gets the XP he just solely deserves. Alright. Mm -mm. Okay, okay, let's be quick about this. What are we doing? Fucking or what? Jesus Christ. Don't let your mama know. It's my chop. Water bolts. Uh, allergies, kids. It's disgusting. I hate allergies so much. They ruined my life. Down goes Machop and Dawn is level 24. All right, Wally, all you. All you, my guy. Welcome to the party.
Oh, why do you gotta detect? So detect, for those who don't know, is basically protect. And that doesn't allow you to use your attacking move. And AIs in the game spawn it like you don't fucking believe. Sometimes they get it like three times in a row, too. It's ridiculous. It's only supposed to be 100% the first time. Then it's supposed to be 50% the second time. Then 33%. And then, you know, so on and so forth. Half every time. And sometimes they get it three times in a row. It's like, are you kidding me? You're just here to waste my time, aren't you? But, um, yeah, we're going to have Dawn at the front of this one. <laughs> Laughter brings good fortune. If that was true, then I would have nothing but good fortune. And the test would show that was a lie. No, laughing brings misfortune, because whenever you're having a good time, sometimes bad shit happens. And for me, it's all the time I'm having a good time, bad shit happens. But, you know, no, I guess not all the time. Majority of the time. It's like, can not? I want to have a good time. Dawn used a water pulse, and Jilded goes down again. Whiskey Coke. Whiskey Coke soothes the soul. You know what I mean. You know what I mean. Alright, so Geo, dude. Dang, I said Amber. I told Amber about Scarlett Johansson playing Selena and she left. She was like, no. I'm out of here. Don't fucking disrespect Selena's name like that. No, I'm just messing with you. <clears throat> I had to say something. You're the only person I could pick on. Uh, Dawn at 219 EXP. Sharknado goes level 19. Wants to learn sand to him. Hell yeah! Fuck sand attack. Hiker Kevin. <laughs> There's nothing I could do but laugh. Well, you could cry. Right, yo. Uh, okay. Quiet nature, so... Plus special attack minus speed. <clears throat> but we are Sandville shark weight. Uh, shark, 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 NATO. We are Sandville ability, is what I was trying to say. Got plenty of revives. We need to go to the place to uh, sell items. Pokemart. There we go. And do that. Go, Tiger. Do that. Do that. Do that. Do that. Mm -mm. <clears throat> We're about to be big ball in a minute. Alright, so we can sell all these revives. Oh, Earthquake is going to be amazing. What do you got for sale? You got full heels? I need full heels. <clears throat> All right, fellas and fe fella, fella, females, fellas, fellas, fe fe fellas, fellas. That's a that's a goddamn shoe brand. Um, fellas and females, fellas and, I don't know, what's the right thing to call women? Women? Women and gentlemen and ladies and gentlemen. There we go. 
Ladies and gentlemen, but this isn't about me. I've got something nice for you. Select the hand left. Oh, you want the bear seeker? That's cool. And uh, I was going to give you both anyway, so who cares? Wow. So the little game of left or right, that, that was dumb. Look, Amber, I don't need your dots, okay? I know I can't talk already. I'm too dumb. All right, Mount Coronet. We probably won't get an encounter here unless it's Changling. Because, uh, like I said, we pretty much caught all the cave Pokemon possible. Oh, wait, we're about to encounter somebody. Ooh. Oh, look, Metatite. That's a Pokemon we can catch. All right, Mud Bomb. Mud bomb. How oh, we missed? Um, I don't know. Jesus, that did nothing. Don't be hitting power grass or electric. They did nothing. Thank goodness. I don't know what I was gonna tell you guys either. I just wanted to say, ladies and gentlemen. Pokeball time, go! Oh, didn't stay in. All right, let's go ahead and bring in Bell. <clears throat> it's a bell. And we're gonna go for Stun Spore. What? She hit it on the first turn? Wow. That's a shocker. Hidden power. Not gonna do shit. No. Let's go ahead and throw a Pokeball here. It is paralyzed and it is also very low on health. Yes! We caught it. Now give me a nickname. For a psychic fighting type Pokemon. Anybody? Anybody at all? Female name? Or male name? I mean, it's 2021. It could be whatever it wants to be, right? Uh, what's a good nickname for Metatite? <clears throat> it evolves into a big ass, weird looking humanoid figure that has pink clothes. So, female name fitting. What are we going with? What are we going with, ladies and gentlemen? Are you ready for the main event? Because right after this, you're about to see some interesting story for the video game. Brucella? Alright, that works for me. Bruce Silla. And it fits. That's what she said. <clears throat> Brucilla. Don't know if we're going to add it to the party just yet, but. Mm. Oh, damn. We could have had a nose pass. Dude, that would have been much better. But let's go ahead and make sure our team is healed. And our team is healed. According to one theory, Mount Coronet is where the Sinnoh region began. Uh oh. RC, uh, the, the, the new games? The new games? Ah, uh, ah! Uh, all based around Mount Coronet? In a newly created world, a world where only time flowed and space expanded, there should be. There should have been no strife. But what became of that world? 
because because the human spirit is weak and incomplete. Strife has spread. This world is being ruined by it. I find the state of affairs to be deplorable. Oh, big word for a kid game. Shut up, you hack. Alrighty there, guys. Um, we are gonna work our way out of this cave because it's not far to go. Um, get one more encounter and then I can officially end the stream from there. So again, guys, uh, do not forget to let your friends, family members, side chick, side dude, side everybody, side family, uh, everyone know to come watch my stream. Because once we get 200 followers on some more gaming, I will be doing a giveaway for some plushies. And you know you want a stitched cotton filled Pokemon for free. So don't at me, bruh. Just get 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 the people here. Get them following. And I'll get you what you need. I'll get you your fix, man. I'm telling you. Or gal. Dames and dudes and dudettes and gents and oh my god, that should be on a t-shirt. Dames and dudes and dudettes and gents. That should be on a t-shirt. I don't care what anyone says. Uh, let's go ahead and put Bell back up front. Don's already level 24. If I beat you, will you share some food with me? Oh, look, a fellow fat ass. No, I will not share food with you. These tacos are mine. All right, let's go ahead and get a mega drain up. And also, guys, do not forget to join us tomorrow at 12 p.m. Central. So at noon, Texas time for the PML draft. Now, it will be about two and a half hours long, maybe. Probably less. <laughs> In the food industry, I've been practically called everything. Yeah, I feel that. Alright, I'm going to avoid some of these battles for now. Because I want to hurry up and get to the encounter right here. Because we can get a Rolt! Dude, if I get a Rolt, I'd be so happy. You know how stacked my team would be? Oh, man. You don't even know. You don't even... We basically have half of Cynthia's team right there. Um, Mega Drain. Mega, 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 Mega Drain. I'm a come, 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 What restaurant do you work for, Eddie? If you're allowed to say. Mega Drain. Draining his life force to feed my soul. Sounds like a woman. I'm just kidding, guys. It was a joke. It was a joke. Backpedaling fast and Deion Sanders right there. Alright, let's get over here. Oh, look at this. We can get an item. Back to work for the night, bro. Catch you later. All right, Eddie, you have a good night, man. Guess he couldn't say. Oh, fuck. I was trying to avoid that battle. Oh, you want to have a battle? No, I don't. But I guess I ain't got a fucking choice. That's what we're trying to evolve. Wow. All right, not to come back in and fuck this dude up. Oh, well, why did I push scratch? I was supposed to push Imba. Now I might hit the poison point. No, I didn't. Good.
Well, I'm paralyzed anyway, so it doesn't matter. Roselia goes down. Sharknado gets some EXP. I might stream again tomorrow, guys. Um, just depending. I always try to do the podcast tomorrow on Saturdays, but you know, you never know. Sometimes people just ain't up. So if they can't join, then I will be streaming. <laughs> Uh, you know what? Maybe not. It's Saturday. People like to go out on Saturday and all that. So maybe, eh, maybe not Saturday. I might have to switch to the two days I don't stream instead of Saturday and Sunday. It's just Friday and Saturday. But we'll see. We'll see. I, I like to try to stream every day, though. Sometimes you can't. Sometimes the lady's just like, I need the attention, and you gotta give it to her. You know what I mean? 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 Um, everyone seems to be calling me the berry master. I hand out berries daily because I want people to learn how wonderful they are. You deserve one Asper berry. Thank you very much. Um, would you like to hold some mulch? Yeah, sure, why not? Oh, shit, I want to buy it. Fuck off, lady. Con man. Are you the forgetful type? Who forgets where berries are planted? Yep. Oh, look, we got the berry searcher app. All right. Let's get our encounter. Oh. Tiny mushroom. We got a tiny mushroom. How cute. All right. What is our encounter? We already have you. You're not our encounter. <laughs> Rolts! We got a Rolts! It's a female Rolts, so we can only get Guard of War. But I'm okay with that. I am okay with that. Just got a boy's a beast. Synchronize. Interesting. All right. We take those. Oh, shit. We got to hurry up and catch this thing. It could teleport away. Don't teleport. Don't teleport. Don't teleport. Don't teleport. Thank you. All right. Shockwave. Don't kill. Don't kill. Don't kill. I, I, fuck, I fucked up. I fucked up. Don't kill. Don't kill. Don't kill. No! Oh, I should have used up rock. <clears throat> Not a good thing, Wally. Not a good thing. Alright, guys. Well, that's it for the day. Nice to end it on a very disappointing note. But, um... We have a pretty good team here. Let's go over it real quick. Damn, it's a lot of save data to go through. Damn, it's still saving? What the hell? Well, we did play a lot. Four hours. Alright, so. Um, we have Bell. It's a Bell. Then we have Natsu, we have Rolu, we have Dawn, Samantha, and we have Sharknado. Oh boy, I'm so happy we got Sharknado. Um, more than likely by the next time we stream, I will have Bell evolved. Because I'm going to run around for a little bit after the stream ends. And I will get everyone up to level 26. Fighting wild Pokemon, because, I mean, it's the only way we can do it. And, um, there's not many people left to fight on our way to the fifth, or uh, the third gym. So, <laughs> we would be fucked if, um, I try to do it on stream next time. So, thank you guys for watching. Remember, tomorrow, 12 Central, um, 12 PM Central, uh, we have our live draft going on. 
uh, get people to join, to watch, to follow. I need people to follow. Everyone you can, just come, come follow. Drop the button. It pop, it's free just to follow. And don't forget to uh, join us on Zamora Gaming website. Or not website, but on Facebook, Zamora Gaming. And that's what we'll be holding the giveaway once we get to 100 followers. And thank you guys for watching again. I can never say that enough. And I will see you guys next time.